What's up, y'all? What, baby? Yeah, come here. This is a hug to give me my gummy bears today. Thank you. No, you sweetheart. Thanks for giving my gummy bears today. <laughs> I mean, later on. <laughs> All right, baby. I'll be ready for them. All right. Okay. Bye. Okay, so let me go on and get some viewers. Um, but I guess you know right now since I don't have any viewers since I just uh, logged in or uh, started the stream, we will maybe we'll just do a quick match. We'll do a quick match, just because. Oh man, I'm supposed to be Supposed to be learning every single weight division. So the only ones I have left to learn are the cruiser weight and lightweight women's. I've really never done this cruiser weight and heavyweight. So the lighter weights um, usually are easier for me to learn. So I guess why not start out with the women? Um, So first start out by let's look at some stats. A couple of stats I like to look at. You know this is uh you know who I am, you know who I am. I ain't even gotta say it. So I'm looking at a few key stats that I normally pay attention to. That's what I'm scrolling through, looking at some stats that I pay attention to to make me be an effective fighter. So a couple of things that uh, I've that I've noticed just going through, and then I'm gonna look at some traits real quick. These ladies have, they're all kind of in the same area as far as uh, overall. And then you just kind of want to match up their traits to however you want your fighting style to be so that you can be effective. What's up, Duke? <clears throat> so we're gonna we're gonna try to be effective, um, the most effective we can possibly be. She's this girl has some really good traits. Her traits are uh, her traits are really really nice. Uh, 
kind of like I like the way she's set up. Um, traits are nice. I think all these females. You in the Discord? All right, hold up, homie. I thought I was in the Discord. Thought I was already in that thing. Let me. Clearly, I'm not. Yeah, I wasn't in it. <laughs> Alright, there I am. What up? What up? Yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying. You know, I was. I was told that you know I needed to be multi-talented, multi-dimensional. So here, here I am on my uh, on my court. Like I'm just fooling around right now, so I might as well uh, start brushing up on uh, my matchups and all the divisions. So. I gotta go from the women's and then go cruiser and then finally heavy. So, <laughs> which one? <laughs> let me see. Let me see. Bridges. This one. Uh, uh, I mean, I don't know. She's you know in her bo her boxer attire, you know. E Ebony Bridges. The the blonde bomber, you know. Maybe if uh, what she look like? Yeah, I can see that they got the character model. <laughs> I can see the character, but she got that. It's a she Australian. Okay, okay. Yeah, she uh, she's older. Thirty six. Oh no, nah, she, she right there with me. She eighty six, class eighty six. I, I mean, not class eighty six, but eighty six birth year. She right there with me. Yeah. Just won a title, man. So, yeah, I was, I was, I was looking at some of these these character models for the ladies. Uh, you know, they're. I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell. Like, they got them all, you know, boxer attire and sweaty as hell. So I can't really tell. <laughs> like, uh, yeah, this ain't, you know, this ain't exactly where I pick up ladies at, at the, <laughs> at the boxer gym. <laughs> if I were to pick one up, they don't have that many fights. They said, "Do uh, you play this all day? Uh, pretty much, bro. Pretty much. I lo I love this game. Um, uh, Mister, <laughs> odd Mister. Yeah, I play this all the time. I play this all the time. It's the I think this Jessica. She might look. She might be all right. You you heard of Bloody Knuckles? Nah." No, 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 Savannah Marshall. Oh, they got a. There's another new boxing game called Bloody Knuckles. I have not heard. I have not heard of that. By the title, I'm guessing this is like a, a Kimbo Slices game. You know, like some backyard boxing. <laughs> Bloody Knuckles. They don't sound like. Yeah, they don't got uh, gloves on. But uh, let me see here. I guess if I had a box with a female, I... <laughs> I guess if I had a fight with a female, I'm probably gonna pick this chick, uh, Chantel Cameron.
<laughs> the switch. Oh my goodness. Yeah. You said enough. You said I look like I need to be on the switch. I'm done. I think th I think this chick will will get the job done right here. She's a 86 overall. She's the highest ranked fighter. So outside of uh, Katie Taylor, yeah. So I probably shouldn't pick her because um, obviously most people are gonna pick the highest rated fighter. So after that, I'm thinking like one of these two. Uh, I'm thinking this chick right here, man. She, uh, Jolina. She looks real mean, and she's got the, she got the high cheekbones, like she don't play around. <laughs> Duh. She look mean as hell. I can't even say the other thoughts I have. <laughs> we just gonna. Yeah, we're gonna keep that all straight. I'm just gonna leave that all. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave that all inside my mind. She look mean as hell, though. She look like she come ready to fight. She got the braids and it's done up in a bun and shit. Like, I'm not here to look pretty. Man, I, I gotta search. I gotta search her. See what she, what she actually look like. <laughs> Hold up. Cause I'm, I'm just, I'm just intrigued because I know this ain't her, this ain't her, uh, her street attire. She don't just walk outside like this. She don't, she don't go to the laundry mat like this. <laughs> I just have to see. What and she's Canadian. She looked like she would be Russian or something like that by that name, Jacobian or something like that. He said, "Let's play." Oh, you want to box me, bro? You you want to be one of the first viewers up? I well, let's play. We out. What? I'll fight you, but I I, I want to practice the women's division first. You want to fight me uh in the women's division, and then I'll fight you in anything else you want to fight. You want to do that? You better hurry up and say some, or this cue finna go through. Okay, she popped up immediately. She like one of the only people named Jelena. What does that mean? Let's play. We out. Fuck it. Man, this ain't that chick. Hold up. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Well, as soon as that face popped up, I, I felt like I got catfish. I'm like, yo, Google, you ain't right. This ain't her. <laughs> um. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Uh, what you think? I'm, I'm finna go. I'm finna get the right female. I mean, to. Okay, let me see. Let me let me pull her up because I got I got a different female. The the last name came up like it came up right. It came up. Oh yeah. She trying to be a fighter for real, for real. Professional boxer. There she go. She says she the oldest one. Oh yeah, she forty years of age. And she's done some movies. She's done Chokehold and Jelena, her own movie. It was a, it was a new movie, twenty nineteen, a new Er movie. And I guess the other one called Jelena. I guess it's like a. I guess she played herself, like a autobiography or something like that. I don't know. Born in eighty two. 
155 total fights. Shoo, she's a she a bruiser. <laughs> 55 total fights. Tough. She got a, she got a lot of belts. I see her with a picture right here. She got three belts on each arm. She belted up, highly, highly decorated. I got the right fighter. Yeah. Yeah. When she ain't. When she ain't fighting, she don't look nothing like in a boxing gear. Not even close. No. When she in a boxing gear, <laughs> she, she a whole other person, man. For real, you know, like ease up. <laughs> you, you, I guess she said she ain't here for all that, all that smiling and hugging. No, baby, it is too early in the morning for cake. Yeah. You can eat cake, but I'm not doing that. Okay, he said he ready. All right, let's re hey, put them gloves together. Mr. You ain't played no rank matches, mister? Put them gloves together. You got to hit the, uh, the right trigger. Right trigger, homie. Let's get it. Okay, okay, to watch all tomorrow. Smoking Joe was good, Joe. Was good, Joe. I'm out here. I'm out here making waves, Joe. I'm out here making waves, man. Killing the competition. That name Hook City, man. <laughs> he said, chilling, smacking folks. Yeah. Everybody, everybody talking about Hook City. <laughs> I'm sending, I'm sending terror through the ranks. You know what I'm saying? Terror. Come on with it. There, what up, Joe? Shit, just knock, knocking people out. It's a regular Saturday. Man. <laughs> yeah, did did get defensive. Like, come on, bro. He out here. I'm 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 gonna say it again, man. He out here half cooked, half baked. You know what I'm saying? With my drip, with my fight style, whooping up on these new guys, and and, and thinking he the man. I'm like, man. I was like, yo. You know what I said? I said, let let him collect some belts. Let him collect them so I could come in there and take all them belts off of them, all at the same damn time. So I can embarrass him. Let him let him get the big head. Shit, absolutely.
Yeah, it absolutely does, man. Um, Yeah, yeah. Oh, I just told him all I had to say was, you know, um, you're gonna have to see me. That's all I had to say is, you know, you're doing your thing, you you won in this tournament, but I ain't been in none of the tournaments you've been winning. You're gonna have to see me sooner or later. He's, yeah, they flipped the car. Yeah, they flipped the car because he was late. So, you know, I, 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 whenever I see something like that, I'm like ducking. He ducking, ducking, yo. GG, Artemar, GG. Man, I told you I'm making waves out here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I, I don't figure it out. It took me a whole lot of hours, but, yo, I, I should, man, like, when I see even a good fighter, like, when I see a good fighter, what I notice is a lot of people are, are, are one-hand dominant. It don't matter if they soft, if they southpaw or orthodox, they one-hand dominant. I just take their hand away from them and make them fight one-handed, and they can't. They come in with one one hand, one strategy. They got one move. I just take that tool out their hand, put it put it over here, and I say, okay, now go reach in that toolbox. Let me see your next tool. That box empty, bro. <laughs> empty. I'm talking about they get they got like a thousand dollar toolbox with a wrench in it. A wrench. <laughs> a wrench. <laughs> oh my goodness. It, yeah, no, it's nothing, bro. Not, not a ten, nine millimeter. It's not. It's not one of them adjustable ones that can really hit like different. You know what I'm saying? It could go, you know, like eight through twelve or something like that. Nah, nine millimeter. He got a nine millimeter from AutoZone. Not even a snap on. <laughs> there you go harbor freight that's the one that's the ticket he come no no uh Yeah, that's his new one. Yeah, that's his yeah, that's his new account. <laughs> hey man, it, you, it can be countered. <laughs> Right. Yep. Yeah. You, yeah. There's no point in caring. There's no point. That day, that's what I say, man. When I be talking all that shit, I say, move, move your head. Move your head. <laughs> it's boxing, right? Move your head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, why would I change? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, one punch was stronger than all four. with no water. Yeah, that's the the game doesn't reward the inside boxer and Yeah. Yeah, he he do got them angles. <laughs> The game does not it does not reward inside boxers whatsoever so until they until they put something in there where where uh inside boxer actually has the ability to like like you said you beat him up and he's injured and he was still able to run when when they put something in the game where they where they uh stop people from being on the hill i'll go back to being an inside boxer but but uh i i'm i might yeah Yeah, you gotta slow down. Yeah. 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 That that's 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 really like let me turn to me. Yeah, what you want? There's like I said, there's there's only six punches in the game, bro. Yeah. 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 You need to go. Yeah, hot pocket. Go back to the gym. Like, like I'm finna this dude right here. I'm finna rock this dude with Dalton Smith. Dalton Smith versus uh, Canelo, and uh, I'm finna I'm finna rock him. Like I can already tell in the first round, he don't got what it take to beat me. Just yeah, yeah, movement, punch selection. Yeah, I see with like which combo we come out with. I'm like, ah, oh, nah, you got you got a first grade combo. <laughs>
is it you throw you throw knees with the Muay Thai clinch? Yeah, yeah, knees. Yeah. Make everybody happy. <laughs> you can't. Yeah, they're just gonna say, "Oh, you lost." Like, yeah, you, yeah. They don't give a fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He had a good right hook, but yeah, man, that dude just went to the body on him, and he couldn't stop it. Like, yeah, I could stop it. Yeah, I could stop it, but you know, you you said that you know, um, whatever stops it is is spam. <laughs> so that's like dumb that's dumb like you just you want me to eat punches yeah <laughs> Button's about to fall off. Oh uh, yeah, like this Canelo, I've hit him on on every every body part because I know you know I'm I'm Dalton Smith, so I just hit him in every spot he leaves open. Like it's not like I'm gonna be able to just knock him out because I don't have enough power. So I just I just yeah, I'm just chipping chipping at his entire body. And this is, yeah, and yeah, don't get chipped. That's the biggest part. And this is a, a, a 1X. Yeah, this is a this is a 1X fight, so the damage is just dumb. So I got to really chip for, you know, eight rounds before I get a knockout. It might, it, it might even, it might even take me 10 rounds to knock him out. Because I'm scared to go in the, I'm scared to go in the loose foot. Because, is it? If this guy, if a Canelo hits you in loose foot, yeah, like <laughs> you're gonna catch that one hit or quitter, and like then you'll be looking stupid. Like right there, he would have KO'd me, man. He he tore my head up right side. Flat. It was a a flash right hook. Yeah, I would have went the. I would have hit the mat pavement. Yeah. So I'm. I'm no, I haven't. I haven't. Is he is he real or is he is he pretend? I I got him. Got him. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was looking at his record. I was like, man, that record like it doesn't doesn't look like he's a real fighter. Yeah, that's what's supposed to happen. It's automatic forfeit. Yeah, it's autom yeah, three three knees is over with. It'll it'll give you the eight count or whatever, and then it just goes to the decision. That's automatic forfeit. Exactly, exactly. So you can you can get knocked out five times. 
Yeah, five. Yeah, five or six, definitely. Very. Is it especially if you use them before the first knockdown? If you use them ahead of time, yeah, you're you're. I'm, or you could use them strategically. You know, just depending on how the fight's going. Yeah. Uh, And I, yeah, and I feel like, I feel like it's, uh, I feel like it's a good strategy. Like, where where it's really good at is if if the fight is close. Like whenever whenever both fighters, you know, get. Let me let. Me. So yo, what's up, Mercy? He said y'all niggas too serious about this game in in the state that it's that it is in. <laughs> we too serious. <laughs> yeah, we we like boxing, man. How how can you be too serious about winning? I just want to know. When you losing, you'll just say get up out of there. Then you gonna say I'm too serious about winning. I'm curious. I'm curious. I pack. I pack ki I pack kids up, baby. Serious or non-serious, you still get the little box. <laughs> Yo, I got this George Davy giving me the giving me the jab. I still boot it up. Yeah. There, there was like at a point in time when I was first learning, I was like, I was like, yo, man, like this, some, this game is like broken. And then when I really started wrapping my mind around it, I'm like, oh, it's not broken. It's just that everybody's uneducated. <laughs> That's all it boils down to. Yo, yeah, yeah, I got my IQ up and ah. Oh. He boys in trouble now. Now they just mad. Yeah, it's it's absolutely fine. If that if you if you think lead body uppercut is 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 why uh people are are winning, then you are sad, sadly mistaken. Yeah, I beat him. It's over.
man. Hey, man. Hey, uh, NS9, bro. You need to uh, go back and watch my last my last video, my last VOD. Um, it was the last fight I had. I fought uh, I fought Fight Night. Man, I shut Fight Night down, bro. I shut him down bad. I shut him down real bad, and I was talking shit while I did it. In the second round, it was over with, bro. Second round. Fight Night didn't have nothing for me. So... This guy, I mean, he's a George Davy. All George Davy has is a jab, so sooner or later he's gonna run out of his jab and it'll be over with. But he he's got a good he's playing George Davy really nice. Oh, I'm like that, bro. I'm <laughs> I'm like that like that. I'm nice with it. I'm hella nice with it. I came here. I came to dominate, bro. I came to dominate, talk shit, end careers. I come here to end the career, baby. I'm that. I'm that guy. If I ain't that guy right now, I'll be that guy next week. You gonna spar with me? All right. You can spar with me. This George Davy, unfortunately, you know, he just can't win with George Davy. This guy's a pretty good fighter, though. Oh, I know this. I know who this is. Man, I'm over here tripping. I know uh, Big Daddy Puff. Yeah, he he's a he's a streamer. I know Big Daddy Puff. Damn, he out here giving me the work. Oh, when you get your PC, I. Right. Yeah, Big Big Daddy Puff is probably streaming right now. He says that you can step your game up. I didn't even look at the name. I just see. I looked down there. I see Big Daddy Puff. Need more more than body cuts. <laughs> Get out of here, Big Daddy Puff. So so you you want me to not throw any more bodies? I won't throw no more bodies, homie. No more bodies, homie. Wait, that's not, I said that shit, that's not even right, because any smart person know, knows that George Davey has the best, one of the best jabs in the game. He's got a nice ass jab, so you want me to fall into that trap and say I'm not going to throw no bodies and then get jabbed to death. I'm not going to, I'm not going to fall for that trap, bro. You just going to lose. You going to lose, Big Daddy Puff. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you that L, and you going to take it, George Davey or not. Uh, back to um, um, my regular television show. <laughs> I have to be a savage, bro. Everybody coming for my head. I gotta be a savage. What you mean? Nah, I'm not gonna be nice. What for? He trying to take my head. In fact, when he beat me, he gonna say, everybody, I beat the DGL champ. I beat BZR, this, this, and that. Well, so I'm not even gonna let you talk. I'm finna shut you up. I'm finna shut you up before you, before you even start. You're not gonna be able to do it. What I'm gonna give you is, what I'm gonna give you is, BZR beat me with nothing but lead body uppercuts, and he beat me with hooks, Hook City. He's a Hook City spammer and an uppercut spammer, and he's this, 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 da 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 da, yada 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 yada. yada. You took an L. Let me, let me get it in the frame. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna give you. Da 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 da. L. <laughs> I can't help it. I can't help it, Big Daddy Po. I, I love you, bro. I love you, bro. But it's just it's in my shit talking nature, bro. I just I I have to. 
<laughs> I have to, bro. Like, I don't think there's anything that, that I, there's nothing I could do in this game and be nice. I just can't. This, they don't have any hug emotes, man. There's no, there's no like, if you uh, uh if you taunt somebody, give them a hug. I can't, I can't hug you, bro. All I got is fist. I know you're gassed, homie. I know you're gassed. It's over with. I fought. I've used. I've used George Davy before, and and he gets gassed out. Sim simulation. I don't know. Uh, uh, this this isn't like simulation simulation. This is just a, a, a what do you call it a, a a quick match. This ain't this ain't a competition. This is quick match. We just randomly got matched up together, and he just for whatever reasons randomly has George Davy, and I just randomly have Dalton Smith, and we just happen to be two streamers that fight pretty well. So look at that. So no need for the screen if it was. So no. Oh, I could see the health purposely. So no need for the screen if it was. So I could see the health purposely. Oh, you wanna? Oh, you you're wondering because like I got the health bars and the stamina bars covered up. So how many in line to verse you? Nobody's in line, Dreezy. Nobody. Nobody, baby. Yeah, it's DGL versus the viewers. So you'll be the first viewer. I already beat somebody. A viewer came in and said they wanted to fight me. I beat them real quick. So nobody else got in line. So he said, Dreezy said he got next. What's a DGL? DGL is one of the fight clubs um, that you can fight in right now. And uh, I beat their number one, uh, their number one boxer. So I am... I am the number one boxer now in the DGL. Have I lost any viewers yet? Nah. Big Daddy Puff right here is trying to give me a run for my money. He almost he almost did some psychological warfare and uh and uh beat me. He almost beat me with the mind games. But then, you know, I woke up and I was like, nah, bro, you're not gonna beat me with the mind games. Yeah, he came to the stream and talked to me mid mid fight, and, and then I almost took the bait. He almost he almost did me up. He almost done me in. <laughs> Number one hooker. <laughs> Bro, yeah, Davey, he's done, bro. He's cooked right now. He's on that back foot hard. He dialed up the power straight. I went right under that thing. Zoop to the body, you know what I'm saying? He told me don't do that no more, but I told him I have to do it. Look at, he got me in rounds too. Look at them rounds. He been boxing me up. But I didn't come. I didn't come here to try to box up George Davy, like that. I come here to knock out George Davy, like that. Yo, what's up, J Locks? <laughs> oh yeah, man, I got you, homie. I got you. 
You know, I'm looking out. I'm looking out for the community. You know what I'm saying? I know you put on a show, J Lies. Boy, your stream be wild, bro. You got all the jokes. You got all the game show stuff. You got all the crazy stuff, J. That shit be that shit be cold as hell. You wanna get entertained, y'all. Hey y'all. You wanna get entertained? <laughs> Watch J Lock's gaming stream. That guy got the entertainment. You want to watch some boring ass boxing? Come here and watch BZR. But if you want some entertainment, J Locks is where it's at. Damn, I'm finna get boxed up. I think I'm I might possibly get boxed up by George Davy right now, bro. <laughs> no lie, bro. I think George Davy's gonna do, is trying to take me to the cards, homie. This shit is hilarious. George Davy is trying to take me to the cards. He said we we fixing B two two. <laughs> I guess I beat you twice and you, you beat me twice or something like that. George Davey trying to take me to the cards, homie. <laughs> this one is for the joke book. For the jokes. I beat you the first time ever, then you won the next two, and then now. Well, what I tell you, people, people, got, people got a record. They got a record book out on me, man. They pay they paying attention to BZ. They know exactly what happened. I don't remember all that, but I'm gonna trust in what in what Big Daddy Puff says. He says, I got affiliate. I just don't wanna stop multi-streaming yet. Got my mind like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? You know what, Jay? Let me holler at you, homie. I'ma DM you, ho. Homie, it's not ho. I said I'm gonna be, I'm gonna DM you, Jay. Let me holla at you. I'm gonna DM you, bro. Too many weirdos in the community. Be like, I beat you in quick play. I lose all the time in quick play. It's for practice and things. I'm bad. <laughs> yeah. This is clearly not a. This is clearly not a, uh, this is just quick play. That's all this is. This ain't, this ain't for, this ain't for ranked. This ain't none of that, bro. He just boxing me up with George Davey and I happen to be Dalton Smith and, uh, he might get me. He might not, but he damn show, he damn show looking good. He damn show looking good out here boxing me up with George Davey. Oh, you want in on attorney? Yo, J Locks, man. You know what, J Locks? You need to, you know what you need to do, bro? You need to go ahead and join and join the, the fight camp. You need to go ahead and join MBK, bro. And let me put you up on game, bro. Let me put you up on game. That's what you need to do. You need to go ahead and join MBK. And uh and I'll go ahead and give you some pointers and things like that. And then you can, um, and then you go ahead and get in one of them tournaments and show out and win. Show, you know, show them what we do. What's that? Join it where? <laughs> he said, join it where? Yeah. Uh, damn. Uh, when Dre, Dre get in here? No, Joe from the John might have a link with Dre or Joe from the John. Send the, uh, the MBK discord link. Um, you can go to that Discord, bro, and uh, they got a little short application or whatnot, bro. And then uh, you can hang out with in the Discord with us. And, uh, you know, like I said, like I always tell people, uh, yeah, yeah, the NBK Discord. And uh, I always tell people, you know, man, I would, I will uh, 
train with you one on one personally. Personally, give you some fight mechanics. Let you know what you need to know. So that you can uh so that you can get some dubs in the tournament. Yeah, yeah, I got you, bro. Oh, I can't believe. I can't believe Davey. Davey got the, got the extra saucy jab. He got the sauce jab. And he been wearing it out. He said, I got, I was on sale from level. There you go. There go, Dre. King Dre. Man, hook up, hook up J-Locks with the, uh, with the Discord right there, man. We finna get him in MB, uh, MBK, man. This guy, this guy is entertaining. Hook him up with the Discord. We gonna get him up in here. Get him in the spars. Get him right. He said he wanna get in the tournaments, man. We gonna get J-Locks in the tournament. Get him right. We just we just got like a, a light little questionnaire, you know, type thing, you know, just so we don't have no foolery going on in NBK. You know, Dre might go over that with you, man, because we done had some problems with the with a few characters. I'm pretty sure you're not one of those characters, Jay. You're not one of those characters. You know, I've I've been to your stream, I watch you and stuff. You're not one of those type of dudes, but uh, you know, just protocol. Just protocol, man. We didn't we didn't have some some foolery going on. He said sixty five stamp. I bet you won't say that in a custom match. <laughs> I'm I'm fooling around. I'm fooling around. He said sixty five stamp. He jabbing me to death. He running. He dipping. He hiding. He boy. He going to the cars. He George Davy in his way to the cars, y'all. But I want this man. To, hey, go ahead. Ring it up. DZR versus Big Daddy Puff. It is two and two. We are dead even, y'all. Dead even. But anytime Big Daddy Puff want to come to the stream, because he might take me right now. He might take me. But anytime he want to come to the stream, Big Daddy Puff, and he want to he wanna do the tiebreaker, at any point in time, you could come tiebreak me. Any point in time, baby any point in time you could tie break me you could tie break me today to my the next day next month next year because uh i didn't know it was going to be this type of fight if i had known it was going to be a, a sticky move type of fight which i should have known this is george davy i would have uh i would have set that up I would have set that up to be look like watch this watch this i'm gonna show you how i do stick and move you ready you ready just like this i'm gonna show you how i do it Ooh. oh and he gave me a cut with that are you serious he cut me with that. That's crazy. Look at that cut. Only application to application to show we have fat too many soft people join Lee because they couldn't take the trap. Yeah, man. You come you come into the NBK, the MBK camp, bro. You know I'm talking shit. And and some of the other dudes, we top heavy. The top players in the camp, we talking shit while we spar. If you can't handle the heat, get out the kitchen. Yeah, 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 man. Application. Yeah. We talking shit. Application. I got guys out here coming to the NBK camp, you know what I'm saying? Taking they taking my drip, bro. They out here taking my drip. They want to be Hook City. 
and then they want to go out and win win some tournaments acting like they hook city and they don't want to give no credit they don't want to give no credit they want to take my drip and then they want to act like they me the problem with that is eventually you're gonna to have to see me you're gonna see me I'm not in every single tournament but when you cross paths with me I'm gonna beat the brakes off you What's up? What's up, Command Cho? Cam Camacho, my bad, Command Cho. What's up, Camacho? <laughs> I did it again, Camacho. Yeah, I don't have my, I don't have my, uh, my things going and shit. Well, I'm getting boxed up by Davy. Who gets off Monday and Friday? Not fucking. Who gets off Monday and Friday? Well, not fucking me, that's for sure. <laughs> I never. I can never turn you anyways. I work when y'all play. Yeah, yeah. I know how that is, bro. Yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about, Mercy. The tournament times and work times. Yeah, they don't. They don't go together, bro. How's it going today? Got main event <laughs> with the par six? Hell nah, bro. Hell nah. Ain't no Parsex main events. I do got a I got a fight coming up. I don't I don't know where I am on the card. I don't think I'm a main event. I might just be like a regular fighter or something. I might be like a co main event. I'm not really sure. Yeah, that Parsex is whack, bro. Everybody know it. This George, this George Davey done, done got me, bro. The George Davey done got me. Cut me up. Busted up my head. Got the dub. For y'all that don't know it, look at that. Look at that. George Davey can box. George Davey can box. He better not take no punches. He can box, though. <laughs> nah. I, I know I know how it happens, man. He's got he's got the best jab in the game. That counter jab right there, he'll light you up. You're gonna win on a scorecard right there. He just hit me with it. You're gonna win on a scorecard like that every time. When he throw that jab, that's gonna get you the points. And that's what he did to me. He got the scorecard with the jab. Appreciate the fight. GG homie Ooh. What what did I do big daddy puff you beat me bro I said GG You won I said George JV got the jab he boxed me He boxed me up you got the dub I'm not going to cry. I take L's all the time. I got 143 L's right there. George Davey beat me up. In a quick match. <laughs> there you, yeah, there you go, man. There you go. Yeah, and, and give and give Big Daddy Puff a follow, man. Give him a follow. He says I was thirty damage and sixty stand by the end. Now that's because my man, 
my man uh Dalton Smith, bro. He's not going he's design he's designed to invite somebody to fight him. And, and the fight actually went the opposite way. I wasn't I was not when I picked when I picked Dalton Smith, I was not expecting somebody to pick a lower pick than me. <laughs> so that shit backfired like a motherfucker. I was thinking I was going to Dalton Smith versus like Sugar Ray Robinson or something where the fight would come to me. But instead, I was doing the chase. <laughs> and I knew that George Davey is a back foot fighter. He going to be on the back foot and throw the jab. But I was expecting Dalton Smith to have a little bit more top end damage to uh to take out george davy stamina and go ahead and win which he did not have but that's what happens when you fight um when you're playing a lot of competition with like 1.5 stam and you're using higher higher rated fighters and then you try to go to a lower rate or fight lower rated fighters with less power and the 1x stam instead of the 1.5 stam and all these different statistics and then you know the fight doesn't go as planned but like I said he got the dub that simple uh shit yeah I, I give you I give you an option you want welterweight or lightweight you tell me homie you want welterweight or lightweight <clears throat> He wants the welter. All right. Around here we rock. We, around here we rock in one point five damage, one point five stamina. So ah, oh, Dreezy, don't do it, Dreezy. I'm tell you right now, bro. That's not the fight that you want. It's already over with before the fight even start, bro. I'm gonna I'm gonna put I'm gonna pick Sugar Ray Leonard and I'm gonna box you up, bro. It's already over with. Pick pick somebody else. You want to go to you want to go to lightweight uh lightweight or something like that. Don't pick Canelo, bro. It's, this fight's over with before it even started. Don't do that. I don't even have time for that fight. Unless you really just want me to beat the brakes off of you. Yeah, you can spar Silent Viking. You can spar. Do you really do you really want me to beat the brakes off you, Dreezy? That is a bad fight, bro. That is a bad matchup. I'm telling you right now. It's gonna be ugly. It's gonna be really ugly. You don't you don't want that smoke, bro. That's a bad don't don't pick Canelo. Don't do it. Oh, here we go again, bro. Here we go again. Here we go again, bro. Yo, Silent Viking, you you can fight me next, bro. You can fight me next. I try to tell Dreezy this is not the fight that he wants, man. But like, this is this is you don't want to do this. This is like one of the worst matchups in the game. This is a bad matchup. But he said he said let's go. He said let's box. So it is what it is. I could I could have probably took it easier on him and probably went with Ricky Haddon or something like that, but then I'd probably get my ass kicked and then I would look like a clown, like an ass hat or something like that. So I'll just do what you're supposed to do. What you're supposed to do is put Sugar Ray Leonard versus Canelo and then you win. So I'm a, I'm, a, I'm for all y'all guys that may have uh we lost we don't have a good connection, Dreezy. I'll put it back up here again. Yeah, yeah. I'll give you another one. We'll do it again. For all you guys that have a hard time with Canelo, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you what to do. Because there's still some people out here that have a hard time with Canelo. So I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna give you the sauce. I'm not gonna tell you the sauce. You just gonna have to see the sauce. All right, Mercy. I'll, I'll holler at you, Mercy. 
I'm not going to give you the sauce. I'm just going to let you see the sauce. You can figure you can figure it out. You can figure it out on your own. Come in here with Kel Brook, Viking. Do you want Do you want me to fight? Do you Do you want me to pick a lower rated fighter? You want me to match your energy? Like I could I could go with Ricky Haddon versus Kel Brook. He said it don't matter. Play whoever. All right, you feel that confident? You feel that confident? I was gonna match the energy, but you feel that confident? I feel that confident too. I feel confident to not match your energy. I try to get, I try to get everybody what I, I try to get everybody what I believe to be a fair shot to make the boxing matches fair what well, i believe fair i give them that opportunity but when they don't ask for fair i give them that opportunity to get knocked out that's what i give them when they when they're like they don't need fair when they don't need fair bro then shit it is what it is Now, I don't always show all my tools in my bag, but I know you, Viking. I believe you had you're a high level fighter, so you're gonna see some different tools than what normal what everybody else sees. You're gonna see some different stuff. If you come out here and, and uh try to knock me out, try to take my head off, I'm gonna show you some different looks. Why are you talking about that? It don't matter. You almost got KO right there. Look at you. You almost got KO. I told you. I told you. I told you I was going to give you some different looks. I almost gave you a one hit KO. I don't I don't play everybody the same. So people might look at me, they might look at me and say, "Oh, BZ just does this and he does that." No. If you're deserving, if you deserve, if you deserve the sauce, I give you the sauce. Everybody don't deserve the same treatment. If you deserve it, if you deserve it, I give you that thing. I, ab I absolutely destroyed him. Yo, what about you, Cracky? What you what you mean? Are you asking? Are are you deserving of the sauce? Is that what you asking? You fight tonight? Yeah, I fight today. I sure do. Uh, at three o'clock in about in about uh three hours, three four hours, I'll have a fight. I'm fighting somebody named Raven on EBF. Boy, he almost boy, he almost caught the KO right there. I landed the punch. Oh, there it is. There it is, bro. I almost one punch KO'd him. 
I landed it, but I didn't have enough stamina when I threw the punch. Y'all can't see the stamina bars? I can. When I threw the punch, I only had like 30% stamina. I almost KO'd him with one hit. They he, he didn't post a card yet? He said he was doing a card last night, and he still didn't put it? Yeah, if you want to go net, oh, well, wait a second. I think I got to fight the other guy first, Kraken. Uh, Dreezy. Dreezy was supposed to fight me. After I fight Dreezy, then, then I can fight you, Kraken. put my shoes on it's finna get worse it's finna get worse bro all right viking it's finna get worse viking i got my shoes on yo angles what's up baby that's my dog right there all right i got this light box for you i'm finna pack you up I got this light box for you, bro. You finna get the pack. It's your toothbrush and a pair of drawers. All right, all right. He want to pick and pop me, bro. He want to pick and pop me right now. Okay, so that's what we going. We on the pick pop. All right, he's he on the counter punch. He want to pick and pop me. So we'll we'll take it slow. We gotta slow it down. We gotta slow it down a notch. We gotta slow it down a notch, bro. Okay, give me a second to just walk up. He trying to, boy, I seen this shit coming along. Boy, you almost got your head taken off. I see this shit coming a, a long ways away, bro. He want to pick and pop. He slowed it down. He done turtled up. He done got in the shell. He done turtled up in the shell. So I'm going to stay on his head. You got a long ways to go if you want to turtle back into this game. I'm up three points. You got a long ways to go. And you're not going to be able to do it. Because now I'm going to cut you off. Now I'm going to cut you off. Since I got you on the back foot. Oh, I got, I got footwork too now. I got footwork too. I'm going to cut you off. So you can go ahead and take this L. Or you can stay on the back foot. I'm going to keep it coming. I'm going to keep it coming. And I can tell you right now, I can tell you right now, Kell Brook, you kind of using Kell Brook right, but you kind of using them wrong. You got them right and wrong at the same time. It's kind of hard to explain. Boy, he almost got KO'd right there. That was almost a KO. That was another one. Boy, it was real close.
Real close. Paparazzi, baby. Paparazzi. Paparazzi, baby. I don't I don't think Brooke can stay alive. I don't think he's gonna live. Took him to Hook City right there, y'all. That was a little Hook City. Oh, this is an old school move. This is one of this is one of the first moves I came up with. Let's see if he go for my old school dance. Oh, he almost went for the old school dance right there. He almost went for my old school dance. Oh, he picked my pocket. He picked my pocket. I tried to give him the old school dance. The Viking too good for that. He's too good for that. Now y'all know Viking is kind of like a Viking up there, y'all. He ain't he ain't no bullshit fighter. He ain't no bullshit fighter. But he he can't one thing Viking can't do is he can't go to the phone booth with me. So he's he he's on this he got to pick and pop me. He got to pick and pop. He can't go to the phone booth with me. So now, now I'm finna give him the angle special. I'm finna give him the angle special, bro. <laughs> what that man say? Discord is confusing. ASL, help somebody help. <laughs> Boy, that's hilarious. Discord is confusing. I'm finna give him the angle special now. Oh, he almost caught the fade right there, homie. You know better. You been in the ring with me again? You been in the ring with me for six rounds now. You know better. Oh, again you caught the fade. He going to Hook City, bro. Kell Brook going to Hook City. I can see it right now. He don't want to learn. He don't want to learn. He don't want to learn. Kell Brook going to Hook City. He didn't want to learn. I told you. I could see it right now. He did not want to learn. I gave him the Hook City. I I gave him the Hook City in drive, and then I threw that thing in reverse. I threw it in reverse, and I gave him the Hook City the other way. You know what I'm saying? Some of y'all ain't truck drivers. Y'all ain't know that BZR is a truck driver, bro. I hit I hit that motherfucking selector. Pop, pop. You know what I'm saying? I threw that thing in. Second. Third. Fourth. Fifth. Sixth. And I hit that selector. Back over. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. I'm a truck driver too, y'all. Usually feels way too laggy. The game needs fixing. For me, it felt delayed. Trying to follow, trying to follow directions will be easier verbally. Sometimes it's no responsiveness. If you know what I mean. I know exactly what you mean, Silent Vi uh, Silent Viking. Yeah, there is, there is a responsive problems in this game, and that's exactly why I said you can't play this game on parsecs. It's already. There's already uh, response problems, already like delayed response problems built into the game. And then you add parsecs on top of that. It takes like three to four seconds for your punch to come out on parsecs. And I was like, man, fuck that. 
and I fight instinctual. So if you're fighting me and you feel that my punches are coming out really fast, it's because they are coming out really fast. Like literally, I do not think, I throw. I don't think at all. As soon as I see an opening, I throw the punch. I do not think. I've been practicing real hard, real hard. What you think I'm doing? Oh, you think I'm over here twiddling my balls? I'm not twiddling my balls, bro. I think real, I practice real hard. I practice, I practice, I practice. So that, so that I can fight and talk shit at the same time. Anybody can fight and talk shit at the same time. They've been practicing. I stay in the gym. I stay in the gym. Dreezy. Dreezy, you up next, Dreezy. Come on, go ahead, bring that Canelo so I can show you why you should not be playing Canelo. Go ahead and bring him out. This won't take too long. This won't take too long. Go ahead and bring your Canelo out. Yeah, the yeah, the key is the openings and the timing. So the thing is, if you're fighting somebody and you see openings, you can't think about what's the correct punch to throw. You have to already know. So when you're fighting and you see the opening, you can't be like, um, should I? Um, is you know, is this really a high risk reward? You gotta, you gotta already do it. As soon, as soon as it happens, as soon as you see it, it's like open it, pow, pow. He did this, pow, pow. He did that, pow, pow. You gotta like keep going. You can't be like, um, okay, um, okay. You can't. There can be no um in your hands. As soon, as soon as I see a guy jab me, lead body. As soon as I, I see a guy hook me, step back, hook. You know, immediately, like I know what I'm gonna do. If I'm in a weave out, bow, I'm I'm a weave hook immediately. I'm not gonna be like a oh, weave. Oh my God, I'm happy he missed. Now hook, nah, bro. I expect him to miss, and I expect me to hit. Like I know exactly what I'm gonna do. As soon as I come up on one two, one two, one two, hook. You know what I'm saying? Like I know what I'm gonna do. I'm not thinking about what I should do. I know what I'm gonna do. Okay, okay. You say you got a short on my boxing channel. I have high boxing IQ as well in IRL. Yeah, I mean, I w like, I did not know how much I liked boxing until I played this game. Like boxing is like, I really like boxing. I wish. I had to try boxing at a young age because what I've learned, like just playing this game and like just starting to watch some boxing and things like that, this boxing is definitely uh, more more mental warfare than it is physical. Like if you don't have the right tools, you're gonna lose. You're gonna lose every time, bro. Like if you don't have the right the right tools on how to how to combat somebody how to counter somebody bro you're going to get beat up if you're going in there yeah into we're looking for commentators as well you know we got we got we got jobs we got positions available he said he treat this game like it's Tekken. He got the he got the light punch confirmed, bro. You stay you step into some shit and then he put you in the fucking c c c combo breaker. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> he put you he put you in in the mix, man. King of the Iron Fist type shit. All of a sudden, uh, what's his name? What's the dude? Uh, the dude from uh from Tekken, uh, the Jaguar dude. I forgot his fucking name, bro. All of a sudden, your ass get put into an endless loop of a fucking grappling, uh, you know, uh, what do you call it? An endless loop of throws, man. King, yeah, king. All of a sudden, bro, you fucking whiff a punch and you get stuck into an endless loop 
a king just dunking on your ass, just slam, get up, suplex, get up, f- fucking jump up and spin, and just bam, 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 just slamming your ass, endless loop. Yeah, that's that's what you're supposed to do. Yeah, spacing with punish, king be on that, king be on that bullshit, bro. You trying to break out of a, 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 a king, just like slamming your ass all the time, bro, it's, ooh, it's, it's rough. It's rough trying to deal with King. Yo, somebody was supposed to be up in here fighting me. Anybody that want to fight? Any viewer that want to fight? Come on in. Because somebody had a line. Uh, it was Dreezy. Dreezy was in line. And now he's not here. So, you know, next man up. Next man up or I'll just do a quick match. Oh, he went to touch the grass real quick. He said he'll be back and gave and gave up a spot. Okay, I I didn't know exactly what what touch the grass uh means. <laughs> oh, you fought Surge last night. You was the Sugar Ray. You was the Sugar Ray that he fought versus uh he was uh playing as um uh, what's his name? He was playing as uh Sergio Martinez versus Sugar Ray. That was you. Lola went outside. Is Undisputed any good? Chat, tell this man if Undisputed is, is any good. Don't listen to me. Listen to the fan base. Pujashi says, is Undisputed any good? And thank you for the follow, uh, Poon Joshi. Thank you for the follow. Uh, yes, um, since the chat is not uh, responding, Undisputed is a great game. And it is very in-depth and very technical. And it takes some time. It takes some time to learn. Uh, let me tell you, man, it's the best $30 I ever spent. Now, I put a lot of time in the game to be knowledgeable on how to fight and how to win. Not everybody is willing to put in 400 hours. You know what I'm saying? Not everybody is willing to put in all the hours that I put in to learn how to play this game. Um, But yeah, I think this game is very good. It's well thought out. It's very in-depth. And, uh, and, I, and I very much enjoy the game. Like I said, that's me. There are plenty. Man, I ran across a cheater today, bro. I ran across a cheater today, man. I knocked him out four times. He got up in like two seconds, turned on the cheat code, and hit me. You know, one hit punch me, bro. Turned on the cheat code and knocked my ass out with one punch. Man, if you want a good boxing game, <clears throat> if you want a good boxing game, this is it, bro. One stop shop. I love this game. I love this game, bro. I done took some weeks off of work. I done took vacation to just sit here and play this game. I love this game. This game is amazing. Yeah. So. <clears throat> As you can see, the boogie right there, uh, I, I like I like the little boogie emoji. You know, they, they got like some Soul Train dance line right there. Them some real thick sisters. You know what I'm saying? I like that emoji. And yeah, there isn't any competition. It's, 
either you want if you want to play a boxing game you play this game or nothing there's no other boxing game out right now is this game or nothing and just so happens this is a good game so it ain't like you take it's not like take Madden like like Madden has no competition and you like play Madden or nothing else like this game is nice super nice if I could get somebody in here nobody it looks like nobody's gonna come to fight me right now so I'll just uh I'll just back out and uh I'll do a, a, a quick match You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do like I always do quick matches in welterweight. I got a great idea. I'm gonna do a quick match inside of lightweight. How about that? A lightweight quick match. And I hate to be cancerous and pick Sugar Ray Robinson, so maybe I'll go with uh I'll go with I'll go with Crawford. This way if I'm Crawford, I can handle a Linares and I can handle a Sugar Ray Robinson. I'm kind of like right in the middle. I can handle who I need to handle. <sighs> I mean, I could have I could have went with with my boy Ricky Haddon. I could have went with Ricky Haddon, but man, once you have to go up against Crawford and shit like that, bro, you have to you have to slow the game down. <laughs> oh, look at this matchup. Ryan Garcia versus Terrence Bud Crawford. So this is gonna be over with real fast. So he's done already. I told you it was going to be over with real fast. I beat him up, and he's out of here, bro. He's out of here. Thank you for the follow. Tell AFR. I guess this is supposed to be Tell AFR. Thank you for the follow, man. Uh, so I told you it was going to be real fast. I gave him that thing. Took that man to Hook City, and he said he had to go. Took that man, I, I showed him around my city. I'm driving around. Let me show you around my city. Did him just like that. Yes, you can join. Need more people like you, bro. <laughs> GG, thanks for the spar. I have a card today. You know, angles. If you're gonna if you're gonna be hanging around, I I actually need um I need a spar as well. Angles. If you're gonna be hanging around, maybe right after uh me and Kraken spar, I got a fight today as well. I would like you to play um Sergio Martinez. Oh, he said he got me, y'all. He said he got me. I love that. If you would play Sergio Martinez, it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be Sugar Ray Leonard versus Sergio Martinez. 
and I just want to, you know, test a few things out. So the man say he got me. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, what what weight class? Yeah, Sergio's a naughty, naughty boy. He got them lightning hands. He got that that boy slap you up. You know what? We're going to go to lightweight, bro. Lightweight. How about that? Yeah, you know, I like to I think I like to 1.5 stand, but I don't think the fight we we we'll, we're going to practice in 1x stamina because I think the EBF uses 1x stand. So we'll practice one. If it's in 1.5 stand, that'll be in my favor because I love me some 1.5 stand. But I believe the fight's going to be 1x. So my man picked, who he picked? Jono Carroll, that's who he got. So I'm going to come out with, with Arturo Gotti. Let's see if you got a good strategy cracking. If you don't have a good strategy cracking, I'm going to pack you up. We friends and all, but it's going to be a light pack. You see this bot right here? This bot right here? I need you to put your 9mm wrench in it, a toothbrush, and a pair of drawers. That's it. I'm pack you up, homie. You better have a good strategy. All right, so he on he on that counter puncher thing with me right now. He's on the counter puncher. So I just need to be a little bit more patient because he's being patient with me. We're going to slow the fight down. Almost knocked him out right there. I threw a knockout punch. I almost caught him. Try to take him to Hook City. Try to take him to the city. Oh, there it was. There was a knockout punch. Boy, I wrapped it around the back of his head. I wrapped it around the back of his head. Boy, if he had caught that thing flush, he would have still been woozy. He'd have still been, oh, oh, oh. he'd have still been working them hands. I know that's one thing about cracking. He likes to work that hand right there. He likes to work that. All right, cracking. Now, now you know I know some things, so I'm gonna I'm let you be you, but I'm about to punish you for being you. You know I know some things. I'm about to punish you, so don't be surprised. Don't think it's lucky. Don't think it's lucky. I'm gonna punish you. Ooh, that was nice, Kraken. That was nice. He almost gave me a flash KO right there. Oh, 
All right, we got some cerebral warfare going on right here. I'm trying to catch Kraken slipping. All right, I almost caught him. I almost caught him. How you get flash KOs? You got to you got to have real high boxing IQ. You have to um you have to anticipate what somebody's going to do. Or just get really fucking lucky, as everybody likes to say. They like to say that it's a uh, luck base. And it comes out a lot like that. It comes out a lot as as luck base. But uh, I am I am of the mindset that it is not luck base. Flash KO is not luck base. I know I know which which punches can KO somebody, and all you got to do is time somebody. And I was I was real close to timing him, and he caught me. I don't know if y'all seen that punch. I was going down mat, and he caught me in the body, and he folded. He folded Gotti. Like it took him a long time to uh to um start moving again. He he almost he almost gave me the flash knockout. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, pretty much. You hit him. Your punch has got to get there right when the enemy's starting to open up, and uh, that's all she wrote. That's all she wrote. Also, if you catch the enemy flush right on the face, that's a good way to do it. If you catch, if the punch is real flush, you gotta have real good timing. Oh, I caught him, I caught him, I heard him. Oh, he caught me. He caught me with the power straight. He did he did it again. He trying to dial me up on the power straight. He trying to dial me up. Oh, I'm I'm trying to get you, bro. I got that killer punch, bro. Watch me. Watch me. Now you know I'm nasty. Watch out now. Nah, nah, I don't have to be no power punch. You just have to throw the right punch at the right time. It could be a power punch counter. You throw the right punch at the right time, and yeah, you're going to get a flash KO. You just got to know what you're doing. Yo, what's up, Lucos? Trying to box up my man's cracking right here. My man, the boy is tripping. I'm spamming. That boy got boxed up real hard, bro. Boxed up real hard. Tell him what happened, Lucos. What happened? I shut that boy down. I took his toolbox and I dumped out. I took that toolbox and I dumped that one little nine millimeter wrench dumped it on the ground he ain't have nothing left oh we lagging real hard right now Oh, I heard him. I heard him.
Hurt him. He hurt. Paparazzi, baby. Paparazzi. I just beat the shit out of an Ali hook spammer. He came into my stream DM crying. <laughs> 883 punches thrown to 758 hooks. Boy, it is what it is, bro. It is what it is. You got to run him up out of there. You got to get him up out of there, bro. Kraken right here is putting on a pretty decent show. Pretty decent show. It's looking real nice for Kraken, but I think I'm going to get him. I think I'm going to take Kraken out. I'm sending them boys back to Tekken. <laughs> I think I'm going to get him. If I don't get him, I'm blaming it on Gotti. It's not me. It's Gotti's fault. I'm blaming it on Gotti. Oh, I caught him with the KO punch. I've been I've been looking for it all fight. Ooh, I sneaked him. I sneaked him. Remember that one that wrapped around behind his head? I landed flush that time. I've been looking for it all fight. I've been looking for it all fight. I snuck him. Yeah, stick for it, stick for the hooks, yeah. Caught him with it again. He's been susceptible to that to the KO punch. He lucky, I'm a little tired. He's tired, I'm tired. trying to sneak him with the KO punch, man. You got to you got to know how to kill somebody. You got to know how to kill your opponent. And I, my friends, I know quite a few ways to kill somebody. bro i'm gonna uh you know what i'm gonna catch you just to show you don't that i know what i'm talking about i'm finna catch him y'all he finna do it again i'm gonna sneak him watch he gonna do it i'm gonna sneak him soon as i see him do it i'm gonna sneak him i missed it there it was there it was i missed it there it go again I'm going to sneak him. Just wait a second. Ah, I'm trying my best to catch him. I don't think I'm gonna be able to catch him, man. He he throws he gets it in there. He gets it in there real nice. I think it might just be the fighter. He's kind of he's kind of stubby and compact, and I'm trying to catch him. I'm trying to catch him looking, but I haven't been able to. And the fight's real close, so I don't want to lose the fight by trying to prove a point. I 
can't believe it. I can't believe him, bro. I can't believe him. Tried a couple of new things out right there. This is a spar, so I, I tried something just to see if it worked. It did not work. Nice punch. He probably would have rocked me if he wasn't tired, but he was tired as hell, so that punch didn't do near the amount of damage it should have did. He would have been so rocked right there, bro. I just didn't have enough gas in the tank. Oh, I try to rock him again. He's hurt. Oh, I got him that time. I got him that time. I told you. I told you. Y'all didn't see it? Y'all didn't see it? Too fast, baby. Too fast. Too much speed, bro. Too much speed. You got to know what you're going to do before you do it. Snuck him. Too much speed, baby. And, and God, he's slow as fuck. But my, my thinking was too fast. Thinking was too fast. Got him up out of there. Hell nah, bro. He was mad. He was mad that I done him up, bro. I embarrassed him. And I asked for the fight too. If you, for y'all that don't know, I told I called I told the GGL, give me give me the top rated fighter. I said give me number one or number two because I'm I was already ranked number three. I said I want the number two or the number one, and he gave me the king. He gave me the dude ranked above number one. He gave me the king. I asked for the fight and destroyed him.
Shit, I'm fucking too tired right now. My dude is busted, bro. My dude is busted right now. Fucking Jono's busted. I'm busted. We just two tired ass old dudes in here. Trying to throw trying to throw hands. We tired as hell, bro. How long it took you to get your boxing IQ about playing this? Man, it took me literally like 340 hours, almost like 400 hours before I started getting my IQ the right way. I'm talking about just last week. Like I literally turned it on in like about a week, about a week ago. It took me a long time because I was hard headed and I didn't know I didn't know anything about boxing. So it, it took me it took me any 400 hours, 400 hours easy. I mean, I've seen boxing before, but watching somebody and making the choices yourself are two different things. So yeah, it took me about 400 hours. Ooh, that boy dropped me. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I mean, as far as like, it's still watching. If you're watching YouTube, you're still watching. Like, nobody on YouTube is going to teach you how to fight. Like, I can teach you how to fight right here on this channel. Nobody, like, there ain't no tutorials on YouTube on, on how to fight. S center line, that's, center line is goofy. That's not even a conversation. Center line is goofy. I call it, I call it, um, what's the word I use for it? Um, stick. I call it, um, ah, I call it, um, stick tracking. That's what I call it in this game. You got to know how to stick track somebody. That's a term that I came up with. Anybody, anybody can call it whatever they want to call it. I call it stick tracking. Center line is goofy as hell. You gotta, you gotta know how to stick track somebody. <laughs> oh man, I think I got him, bro. I don't know if he'll get up again. Now, obviously, we was just sparring, bro. That's just sparring. That is just sparring. That was not a real fight between me and Kraken. We was just fooling around, trying to learn some shit, bro. That was just sparring. The fight that me and Angles is going to have, guys, don't take it too serious. We just sparring. We just we just good friends that love the game, and we just sparring. It's not serious. That was not a serious fight between me and Kraken. A lot of people that like to keep track of, of spar fights and be like, yeah, I beat you five times, BZR. You beat me one time. I beat you this. I beat you that. That's not what's going on. It was just sparring. It was a serious spar, but it was just sparring. If you wanted to say who actually won that fight, Kraken actually won that fight. If you really want to know, Kraken actually won that fight. He beat my ass. Now, would I have ever picked a, a Tiro Gotti to fight Kraken? Hell no. I would have never picked Gotti in that fight. 
Like, there's no way I would not have. I would have picked Ricky Hatton. But did did Cracky did Kraken win that fight? He absolutely beat the brakes off of me, and he won that fight. If Kraken doesn't know, I know. If y'all don't know, I know. I know who won and who lost. Y'all can't tell me. I know for a fact Kraken won that fight. But that was just... UFC is on already? It's on this early? Oh, UK time. Okay, okay. Hey, Angles, is you here? Let's see if we can catch up with Angles so I can get a spar in. I needs to learn to do some for me. Yeah, this was definitely warming up for our fights we're going to have today. I got a fight coming up in between three. In between, I can't wait for the Disney Speed Storm racing game. In between three and uh, damn, I'm waiting on angles. I hope we show up. Uh, yeah, I got a fight coming up, probably about three hours and three to four hours versus Raven on the EBF. What do you mean? In two? You, you can't wait to play me so you show show you so you can show me what you mean about what, man? Like what you talking about? What you talking about, homie? You mean like trying to bring real life boxing strategies into the game? I think there's a lot of about boxing, bro. Yeah, I think there's a lot of boxing strategies like real life boxing strategies that like the game looks nice and it's very fluid and things like that but there's only there's only so much you it's it's a game there's only so much you can do it's not like real life as much as you might as you would think it would be it's still just a game you only got like six different yeah you only have like six different punches and uh you can you can put in some of those strategies some of the footwork but it's not very i mean it is what it is it's a game like they they can only put in so many bunch so many punches so many you know so much strategy yeah timing is real life boxing strategy it definitely is when they fix these servers, um, when they when they get a servers to where we don't have a lot of desync, and I can see like right now, um, you may not know this into, but there's a there's a lot of desync. So what I see and what Kraken sees, we see two different things in the boxing ring. Like on my screen, he's doing something different, and on his his screen, he's doing something different. So, um. 
Yeah, <laughs> no parsec, bro. No parsec. Uh, so I'm a, I'm an anticipation fighter. So in order for me to anticipate what you're doing, I can't, I can't fight on parsec. So I'm watching you. I'm trying my best. Like I'm trying my best to watch my opponent, and all I can do is watch what I see on my screen, whether it's the truth or a lie. All I can do is watch the fighter that I see on my screen. Now, obviously, if the servers come up and we have really good connections, and then I can be extremely ex instinctual and I can know exactly what's about to happen. And I think you might start to see, you might start to see more of uh, flash KOs because when, once I get a read on somebody, I know exactly what I want to do and i know exactly how i want to time them and you might start seeing a whole lot of flash ko's out of me i don't know if you're going to see that out of the rest of the community but you're going to start seeing a whole lot um better fight mechanics out of me because like i said i fight with instincts so as soon as you move i strike as soon as soon as you block i throw again as soon as you move i move I strike instantly. Texas Chainsaw Massacre game? That sounds crazy, bro. <laughs> I yeah, I don't know, man. I'm just I'm just here playing games, bro. I have I don't know, you know, I don't know what's gonna happen in the future. I'm just here playing. Well, I guess nobody's going to fight me, so I guess I'll just back out of this and get me a quick match. Yeah, they're trying, bro. I'm going to read my messages, see if I got any new messages. see if EBF put up a card yet they were supposed to put it up last night but it doesn't look, doesn't look like they're putting up a card at all let me see yo thank you for the follow P O A F O uh, I don't know if that's supposed to be afro can you fight me absolutely you can fight me P O A F O absolutely I take fights. Here you go, big homie. This how openings apply to boxing in IRL. Let's see what you got, big homie. I'm gonna watch this video. This is a really bad video. I don't see. That's a bad video. Yeah, I don't like the angle on that video at all. Okay, so. 
Let's do a lightweight fight. Mr. Uh, POA. <laughs> You'll probably lose. You just seen my record. What are you talking about, bro? You came up in here talking about let's box them up. And then you're going to look at my record and get intimidated? My record means nothing. Don't get intimidated by my record. Get intimidated by my hands. That record, I'm better than the record. If, if that makes you even more scared, I'm better than the record. Oh, and he's coming out with Josh. This is perfect, actually. This is perfect. This is absolutely perfect. Yeah, yeah, the, the camera the camera met uh in the shorts it like messes up the camera angle so you can't see everything. Um but yeah, I, I'm yeah, the the different like the difference between like real life boxing and this game boxing is you know, you you have more precision in your actual fist than in the game. Like there's not like there's not real openings in the game like there's real openings in the uh in real life you know what i'm saying like in the game you just hit the block button and all of a sudden your character blocks everything you just hit the block button in real life things are a little bit different fighters are tired they're dealing with pain there's mental warfare going on um they you know they have all different types of defenses they might have a bloody eye and they can't see like your character gets cut in the eye, but you can still see clearly in the game. It's not like half of my screen's all bloody or anything like that. There's so many different things that happens uh, in real life versus the video game. Hey, Dad, you want some food? Oh, yeah, what you got? Spaghetti. Yeah, let me have some. Uh, yeah, I made that a All right, thank you, baby. I get done with that match, you gonna get my gummies like ten out? No, no, I'm not. It's gonna be later today. All right. I hate dealing with southpaws, man. I absolutely hate it, bro. The game is not designed to fight a southpaw. It just doesn't work. Baby, go in there with me playing. Go in there. The game is not designed to fight a southpaw. Put it right there, bro. Thank you. No problem. Yeah, just move the sheets out of the way, man. Yeah, thank you. No problem. I think this is pretty good practice. Boom. 
because my fight's going to be a southpaw fight. So this is pretty good practice for a southpaw fight. Isaiah, huh? shut my door. Coach, got him, coach. Uh, appreciate the fight, POA. Appreciate the fight, big homie. Kids brought me some spaghetti, so I need to eat on this plate. They brought me this little spaghetti plate. They badasses didn't even warm my shit up, too. It's fucking cold as hell. The fuck? I never knew he was that stance. Yeah, he's southpaw. Well, my noodles is cold, but my, but the meat is, is warm, so I can deal with it. Yeah, that man's a softball stance. It means all the buttons are backwards. Go ahead, mute the stream. I don't want to hear me slurping on this thing. Yeah, why not, bro? Want me to run it back? Okay.
Mr. Lightning Hands. In the same car, World Boxing Championship. Yo, you got a link to the card cracking? shit on me go to the fighting schedules I don't know that's the stream I'll ask the owner yeah you, yeah, you don't know when the fight's gonna be they got a card up but they ain't put a date on it What the hell? I don't what time is mountain time? So what time is it right now, Kraken? What time is it for you? I'm in Central. So how long? It's eleven forty-seven. So it's um two hours and thirty minutes basically before the fight. Great. Both of my fights are gonna be scheduled around the same time. Well, I'll have that fight first. Uh cause the EBF fight won't be till about like 3 o'clock. It won't be till like 3.30. I'm second. I'm the second fight. You're a second on this card? Oh, all right. That'll be cool. I get to come in and get my fight, get in and get out immediately. So that'll be, that'll be fine. I'll be cool with that. <laughs> Against the Master Beta, uh... All right. No problem. <laughs> you felt bad. It's okay, POA. As you can see in the top of the stream, it says that I am the DGL champion. So I am not a regular fighter. I'm a champion fighter. The champ. I also go by the name of Hook City. So don't feel bad, POA, at all. Don't feel bad at all. I am a champ. <laughs> Thank you, Kraken. Thank you. <laughs> Don't feel bad at all, big homie. It takes it takes a lot of learning to be good at this game. Oh, absolutely, Kraken. Absolutely. Like I said, you was whooping my ass that fight, bro. You was beating me up. Now, granted, it was it was a Tiro Gotti. I would never ever pick Gotti, and uh, hell yeah, it helped me a lot. I would never pick Gotti in in a, in a fight like that. 
of somebody of your caliber, I would I would never pick Gotti against you because you would you would tear me up. But uh, yeah, man, like you have to ha you have to practice, you have to spar, you have to see what works and what doesn't work. Can I link the stream I'm watching UFC on? Check the DMs in the yeah okay yeah absolutely bro. Why does this Nah, bro, this is like all like spyware spam hack shit, bro. This is not a good website, bro. That's not a good website. Every time I take a click a link, it's like sending me to anime stuff and everything. That's a bad website. Yeah, I just don't want to get nothing on my on my computer, man. I don't want to get I don't want to have any problems with any spyware, spam and all that stuff. I don't want to have no problems with that, man. I'm using this thing strictly for gaming and I'm trying to be, you know, the best streamer I could be. So I can't I can't have the all the problems from the hub on my stream. something to drink bro Ooh, I'm thirsty as hell we got a fight in two hours and 30 minutes you said that fight was a uh... you said the fight was a W the WBC 
So we got a WBC and a EBF. WBC. If you say I'm the second fight, yep, I am. I see it. The Italian Stallion versus Harvey, and then DZR versus the Master. The Master B. Then you got Giuliano versus Kingdom Boxing. Kraken. Yo, Kraken, you want a team, bro? Are you on a team? In a fight club or whatever? Yo, in Zach's Begins Museum, there's Charlie's Mess and the Ashes on it. Yeah. Hey, Zach. Give me one second. Whoops. Here. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick match. Oh Let's see if I can get a quick match with the with the ladies. This is the lady I want to use. When I want my daughter to come bother me, she doesn't bother me. When I don't want her to come through here, she comes she comes through like every five seconds. Yeah, man, y'all talking about broken mechanics again? <laughs> yeah, yeah, broken me. I, I did. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, y'all talking about broken mechanics. Yeah, that shit broken. Yeah, I heard it. Hundred percent run speed from start to finish.
Let's see up. Yep. It's a pro it's a problem in the game, man. It's a problem. Break your leg. Break your whole damn leg. Y'all on the Discord? It's an NPC. Uh, duh. Uh, he said, like a big ass rat. It's real. <laughs> like a toddler. <laughs>
hate I hate runners in this game, bro. Like y'all was talking about running. Like I got a I'm in the women's division. This motherfucker's running, bro. This girl is running. Shit. Fuck all that running. Fuck the running, bro. Mayweather been running all his life, man. Shit, yeah, yeah, he 50 and 0. He made some smart decisions. Yeah, like I'm so sick of this, bro. Like I just want to quit this this quick match because it's freaking this person is a rank one gunner for Arsenal. They're a rank one. They got like one fight. On this game, like they just installed us a day and they just running from me and running from me and running from me and running from me. Like, God damn it, man. Just just die. You're not gonna win. You're a level one, I'm a 38, bro. Just die. <sighs> I just wanna KO him so bad. Yeah, I mean, I could win outside too. It's just, it's beyond annoying. Lady Papa Bass. Uh, uh. I could do it. I be eyeballing the shit out of a knockout punch. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I'm looking at you like, bro, if you don't protect yourself, I'm I'm ripping your whole head off. Fatality. <laughs> yeah, the power punch. That's a to yeah, a totally different thing. I rare, I rarely do it.
Um, uh, you know what? I'm done, bro. I'm done fighting this chick, man. I just surrender. I'm so tired of this shit, man. This motherfucker just running from me, running from me, running from me. Uh, fight's over with. I'm going to whoop you no matter what. And it's just annoying. Ugh. I just surrender. Fuck it. Let him out of that shit. <sighs> Man. Just running, just just for the sake, like, I'm on a fucking treadmill, bro, like, my eyes is tired, I'm sleepy, I'm just tired of looking at it, bro, like, you gonna fight or what? I'm tired of looking at it, bro, I just ate some spaghetti, I'm about to catch the itis, you ain't throwing no punches, I ain't got time for this shit. Can't, can't stand people to be acting like that, man. Well rested. <laughs> no oh, man, thirty seconds in. That's ridiculous. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I think you got to get a, a metal, you get a metal plate. Yeah. I'm so pissed, man. I'm pissed right now. Yo, cra Yo, Kraken gave me this link, man, and this link is just full of. Say what? Yeah, I'm, I'm fighting on two different cards. 
I'm gonna be on um, I got an event here <clears throat> I'm gonna be in the, the world boxing championship I'll be the second fight so it'll be early and then right after that I got the uh, the EBF and uh, I don't even know where I'm at. Um, oh, oh, fuck, man. I clicked on this fucking link and now I'm getting all these goddamn pop ups and shit on this computer. And it's pissing me off. I don't know, man. Kraken. Kraken gave me this link. EBF. Let me see here. No, no, I'm saying that Kraken sent me a link to watch some UFC fight or some shit like that. And it was a bullshit, a bullshit ass link. And I got like all these fucking pop ups and shit. Yeah, yeah, but that's not the problem. I'm saying now I got to get this fucking virus shit off my computer. I got this shit popping up on my PC. Yeah, but now they pop up all like now I'm getting these alerts on the side of my computer. It's like saying malware, Texas and shit. Yeah, yeah, so I'm trying to get going right now. Give me a second. Windows Defender. Yeah. Shit. Piss me off. Yeah, as soon as I clicked it, I like I'm like I'm like here it is. Okay, he's like post this thing. I click on it to go to the UFC shit. Then it takes me to like some freaking anime shit. I'm like, what is this? It's not got nothing to do with UFC. Fuck, I don't even know how to get this app running. This is bullshit. Fuck is this? I don't know how to get this Windows Defender to start defending. Some call some virus and threat protection. Maybe this shit will work for me. I gotta get this shit up off my computer, man. Like I can't have this shit popping up while I'm trying to fight. 
I own this damn fucking windows popping up on the side of my screen. They had this problem. I need to take a break, man. I need to, like, I'm f I feel like I'm tired as hell. I ain't got no Cokes or no Red Bulls or nothing. I need to wake the fuck up. I know whenever the fight starts, when the fight starts, I'll be... Chocolate, which one are you talking about? Chocolate about the fight, what? Oh, EBF, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, I see chocolates and fats. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, but I thought they weren't supposed to fight for like another. Is that shit finna go live right now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two feet. Okay, I guess it is about to go. They they're a little early, you know. They're, yeah. And so we, uh, it was one twenty five. So yeah, it's about right. Shit, man. I don't, I don't even want to do that right now. I need to, but I don't. I don't want to fuck go outside. I think it's cold, man. It's been cold in here. Yeah, I ain't been outside at all, bro. It's. I hate, I hate the cold, man. You got a new game in chair? Just off of chair, yeah. So you got, so you got that back, that back burn. Yeah, it has been cold, bro. It's fucking 54 is a high, 38 lows. Like, and I'm good. When, when is it going to be summertime again, man? I need them 80s, bro. Need a 90s. Bring a hunnish. I don't care. Anything but 38s. Oh, man. Cyrus the virus. This is a fucking problem, man. I can't have these goddamn pop-ups, pop man. This is a fucking problem.
I don't know, bro. Like, click on that goddamn link, bro. And now I'm getting these pop ups that saying you might have a virus, you might have this. Go download this, go download that. This is a this is a fucking problem. I keep getting these notifications and I can't get rid of them. Well, I put I put do not disturb, so maybe that'll help me. I don't need no fucking notifications about this shit. Don't disturb. Uh, I just put it on a do not disturb so the pop-ups didn't come in uh, I did scan it didn't find anything so I don't know exactly how to like it's not really like pop-ups it's more like alerts it just keeps sending me alerts so I, I put it on do not disturb to get the alerts to stop spamming me and uh, maybe I'll find something here in a little bit to get rid of those alerts altogether.
what's what's up with it? Like, okay, they got their little card. BZR versus Raven. What am I gonna be the main event? Or the co-main event? This I'll be co-main event, I guess. I'll be watching some of these fights coming up. Um, let's see here. I'll be watching some of these fights and talking, talking about them. I'm gonna go get me some, uh, some water. It looks like I'm gonna be the co-main event of this, uh, of the EBF. I'll be going up against. Southpaw, yeah, Sergio. Um, so we'll just uh, give me one second. I'll be right back with the water. Gotta say, Southpaw versus Southpaw. Fats versus Sergio. So. We'll see how this works out.
watching UFC? No, I'm not watching the UFC stuff right now. Right now, I'm watching uh, some guys uh, fight in the EBF tournament. Just watching these fighters and their strategies. I'll be fighting in the main event, and then after, well, probably before I even get to the main event, I'll be fighting in the, uh, I'll be fighting in the world boxing something. Uh, let me see what it's called. I got another fight coming up. The W, the World Boxing Champions Championship. I got a fight coming up there as well. So I got two fights coming up today. Um, Trying to get some information on my first fight. It should be coming up here pretty quick.
Sergio Cheese, baby. Sergio Cheese. I'm sleepy as hell. What's up, Zay? I'm sleepy trying to wait on the fight. I got a fight coming up in about 30 minutes, bro. I'm about to put on this alarm right here. It's so hard to keep up with these fights, man, because the information just ain't good. And then I got then I got all these main events. These main events I gotta wait till everybody fights. Luckily my first fight is not a main event fight, bro. Fuck, I'm gonna put my head on the desk for 30 minutes. Yeah, luckily the first one's not a main event, but I don't know when they're gonna start. So like help that's not helping me any. I'm gonna fight in the uh The WBC. <laughs> All right, so I'm talking to the dude now. We're gonna do. We're gonna do a lightweight.
I think we're gonna do a lightweight. I don't know if there's any bands. I think I'm gonna be in another. I like to fight lightweight. He's asked me what to pick. So I think it'll be a lightweight fight. See, so he's gonna host it. I'll stream it. Pick a weight class. So he don't wanna do welter, and I really don't wanna fight welter either right now because welter's kinda, welter's kinda boring. Throw the headgear on a day. Oh, Slayer's got a fight and he needs a replacement. <laughs> Angles. I'm gonna, tell, I'm gonna yell for Angles to do the replacement. I like that name, High Block. Man, name is High Block, bro. It's a crazy name. What's up, Kush? I got another. I got one fight coming up, and then I got the co-main event on this uh, fight you see right there on the screen. They got me as co-main event versus Raven. I got a fight coming up. The first fight should be versus um, Masta Beta. Master Beta. Trying to get me a, that's a sick fight poster. Yeah, man, that's pretty sick. I wish they could actually get my fa my real face in there. Put, you know, put me on there with like a little mini fro. As like if I'm the actual Sugar Ray. That'd be cool. Call me the... I'm the bizarre, you know, so I could be like the biz, the bizarray, the bizarray. <laughs> the sugar, the shizar, you could call me the shizar. The shizar. Sigma was good, bro. <laughs> The biz, the biz It's actually gonna be a really hard fight for me, I believe. It's gonna be a pretty hard fight for me versus uh versus the um, Sergio. It's gonna be pretty tough for me, but we'll see. We'll see what I do. Yeah, dep depending on how he fights me, man, it'll be a pretty, it'll be a pretty tough type, a pretty tough fight for me. Uh, a, a pretty tough fight for me.
pretty I pretty much don't like Sergio at all. Yeah, it's it's Sergio, it's not the player, it's Sergio himself as the problem. Southpaw Southpaw in this game is just a problem. My mic is super quiet. My bad, bro. Let me see if I can pull it up close to me. Is uh that a little bit better? It's a little bit better. I got it in front of me. All right, cool. Yeah, Southpaw is a fucking problem, man, in this game. I hate, I hate it, bro. Let me turn on another light. I'm looking real dark in here, man. I'm blacker than what I really am. Need y'all to see my beautiful dark skin. All right. It says, yeah, Southpaw, super tough to fight against. Got some tips next time we chat privately. Man, I need them tips like right now, Playboy. I need all the Southpaw tips and tricks like immediately. Yes. GG Cuts body work is genius I was so low I think I think I got something for the softball But we'll see man I, did, I was trying to get <sighs> I was trying to get in a spar, but give me a sec. One of them I need to show you in a fight so you can feel it, see it, but I'll send you a message now. Where are you going to send me a message at? You're going to send it to me on Discord? You're going to send it to me on Twitch? On the cord. Right. Let me see on the cord, on the cord, on the cord.
taking a second to get this stream going. I don't know what's going on here. Why did this? Why did this stop? Why did it stop working? <laughs> what had happened, y'all? Neighborhood superstar. That sugar right putting it on him. Neighborhood superstar.
Definitely a power nap, bro. Definitely a power nap.
What up, L Block? Man, I'm in this motherfucker sleep hard in a bitch, bro. That took me a good ass nap right there. I think if I get like one more five minute nap, I'll be I'll be chilling, bro. Let me see if I can put that on my alarm. Like 15 more minutes, man. 15 more, minutes. 15 more minute now. Boy, BZ will be killing it. Give me 15 more minutes, man. You know what I'm saying? Even the Sandman got a sleep every now and then. Even the Sandman. Let me get out. Let me get out the little pillow for him. The little bitty pillow. I could really just. Let me just do what I want to do. Can't. Damn. I was trying to get a good little nap, man. I just can't do it. Tired, right, man. Get yourself some mother filling. What is that? Some mother fit vanilla. You putting other people to sleep so much he forgot to sleep himself. Yeah, man. That's exactly what it was, man. I was I was trying to get up early and make sure that you know I got some. I got some training in to make sure I put them to sleep and I didn't get no fucking sleep. Now look at me. Say you see me baptize that dude. <laughs> he say baptize him, boy. Dip him in the water. Uh, hey, Dad, can I go outside? Hey, man, can you bring me back a coke? Yeah. Hell uh, yeah, then you can go outside. <laughs> you better not give me some gun. Oh no. Oh my goodness, little girl. All right, I need you to bring me a coke, man. All right. You a little bit later. You'll get yours later. Okay. I need to go get it? Yes, girl. Oh. Nah, I didn't see it, Zay. We'll have to run it back here in a little bit. Once I once I get these two fights done, man, I'll try to take me a nap or something, maybe, or maybe if my son brings me this coke and I wake up. You know, if I wake up or whatever. Well, yeah, we're going to make some time to check it out, Zay. I think you said you had two videos for me to watch, Zay. Two two fights. So if you got your tapes ready, man, we'll get them pulled up and we'll watch them.
I didn't watch the UFC fight, bro. Says, bro, you got to stream UFC 5 and go pro when it releases. Oh, I'm definitely going to get UFC 5, bro. When it comes out, when's it coming out? London is crazy right now. It took me ages to get to work. Damn, oh, that fight is huge in the UK. I'm definitely, I definitely will be playing UFC 5. Or whatever the next fighting game, you know, boxer slash UFC game that comes out, I will be playing it and streaming it.
Hasn't he already fought Cuban before?
knocked out again. I'm feeling a whole lot better now, bro. I'm feeling a lot better. I just needed like, just needed about an hour, an hour power nap. Yo, that's gonna be me right there, Mota. I'm gonna be against. Yeah, I sleep like a motherfucker, bro. It's gonna be me versus Raven later on, and coming up, I'm gonna be versus uh um. I'm gonna be up against Master Beta here before I fight Raven. Before I fight Raven, I'll fight the Master. But I gotta. I've been tired as hell, bro. I've been sitting right here taking a nap. Yeah, bro, the sand the sandman been whooping me, bro. I feel a whole lot better than what I felt about an hour ago. An hour ago, bro, I was whooped, man. I done took me like an hour nap. And I'm feeling I'm feeling much, much better. <sighs> I'm feeling much, much better. We got Joe from the John going up against Cuban. Wow, this game do got me, bro. This game got me, bro. Got you. We keep the two dollars. Uh, um, what you need two dollars for? Cookies. For what? Cookies. cookies. Yeah. What cookies? It, it's seven. It's two cookies for one dollar. I can. Ready? Come on. Let me buy some. Actually, ready, y'all. Huh? Right. Yeah, you know, dang cookies, but here. Thank you. Thank you for giving me the coke. Nope. They in trouble now. My sons delivered me a coke. They delivered me a coke. Hey, shut my door. Yeah, thank you, shut my door. When was the last time you played Battlefield? I haven't touched a game in about a month. I need to get on my game and supposed to play something today, but I ain't been feeling feeling like that, you know. He gave you the secret weapon. Shit, you know what I'm saying? Share a Coke with BZR. Share a Coke with BZR. They in trouble now, bro. They in trouble. Sometimes 
Sometimes you pick your fighters before. Sometimes you pick your fighter like, <laughs> like real time. Now I got a ways to go before I fight on on uh, the EBF, but I'm fighting on a different fight card, and I'm I'm uh, assuming it's coming up within like maybe 15 minutes. Reek, yeah, bro. I got the coke. I'm waking up. I'm trying to bust somebody head, Reek. I'm trying to bust somebody head. Whoop, whoop. I'm trying to take them to Hook City today. I'm trying to take them. I'm trying to take them to my city. I'm waking up now. They in trouble, man. I was sitting over here asleep on the stream. I was asleep on the stream, but I got my coke from my sons. These men's in trouble. Oh, I got some messages I need to read. Oh, my boy had called me, bro. I was asleep, and he called me. Uh... All right, I just got a message. I just got a message from the uh the the World Boxing Championship. They about to start up. The World Boxing Championship. So you know what I'm finna do. I got to go in there and fight Master. And then when I get done with Master, I'm gonna come back here and uh fight Raven. So we watching my boy Joe from the John right now. Let me see. We're watching Joe from the John right now, and uh, what's he doing? He's up against. He's up against Garcia, and this is. You know, th to me, this is an easy matchup, bro. Like Linares is so is so op versus Ryan Garcia. You can rock Ryan Garcia in the first round with one punch. This is an easy matchup if you're asking BZR. Um, what you don't want to do as George Lanier is, is just let Ryan Garcia pick you apart for, you know, 12 rounds. That's what you don't want to do. Good luck. Good luck. baby. Good luck. Well, thank you, baby. You I love you. Look, you like my new hair? I got them cold. Yes, baby. Yep. Okay, so I'm back to wash my hair. She get cold. All right. So, so 
So that's my opinion, man. You know, if I if I was George Linares right here, I'd take Ryan Garcia to Hook City immediately. Immediately I'd tear him up in Hook City. But, you know, that's me. That's BZR. Uh, I would knock this guy out, I mean, right away. Round one, round two, round three, round four. It'd be over with. Uh, but right now, you know, we got George Linares, you know, kind of dancing around yeah yeah feeling each other out you know eyeballing each other and stuff let me go ahead and uh turn off turn off cyrus you know because his his uh his opinion is is clashing with my opinion you know what i'm saying so let me just get my opinion uh yeah man like this is an extremely easy matchup uh, I would just put I'd put an extreme amount of pressure on on top of uh, Garcia and just end the fight. Um, but Joe, you know, Joe's Joe's working his way. He's uh he's paving his own way and undisputed. Every man, every man has their has their own way. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, man, Joe is feeling it out. He's getting a lot of competition match matches in, and he's up. Uh, he's feeling his way. Um, you know, there's one thing that I don't like that uh, Joe from the John is doing is he kind of gets in that pocket and he and he plants his feet and he goes into the weave. Um, and it does, and he's doing it. It doesn't really seem offensive or defensive. I'm not really sure if he's just tired of running or he's trying to set something up or what. But that's something he does that I, I just don't like. I don't have a taste for it. Um, and if you ask me, it's not working for him neither. I think in some of those moments, he just needs to either be more aggressive or ultra defensive one or the other yeah yeah he gets in that pocket mode and then he's it's like he doesn't really know if he wants to stay in the pocket or if he wants to get out and he just kind of like wiggles around in there and he's like trying to i don't know bait the opponent into something i'm not really sure what's going on there why he does it why he's doing it or why he isn't doing it but um, I I never been a big fan of the of the weave. Ever since I started winning in Undisputed, um, ever since I started winning in this game, the weave has not been a part of my winning. Um, Joe is not in MBK. Joe is in Biz, uh, B I Z. Um, but he hangs out with MBK real heavy, man. He's a he's a good friend of mine on Undisputed, so he hang you know we kick it all the time, uh, no matter what. So I'm not really worried about um, fight camp affiliations, uh, especially when it comes from Joe from the John. But look at that, he rocks Ryan Garcia and he's sniffing blood. That's right, we got us a. Uh, Mex you in the ring with a Mexican shark with the Spanish shark man he's seeing red right now he's seeing red he's seeing blood he's ready to get him when is George is from Venezuela isn't isn't that some type of a uh, Hispanic heritage? I know there's a lot of different Spanish people, just like there's a lot of different um, black people, and there's a lot of different white people.
Oh, and Joe from the John just rocks his world. He is laying down there, face two different colors, two face just, just looking like, you know, what happened? The Spanish Batman got him. <laughs> what had happened? He got pieced up in Gotham City, y'all. George Linares out here crime fighting. And pieced up Ryan Garcia, the Joker. Or we could just say it's Batman versus Superman. And George Lanier is the Batman, is the kryptonite. He has a kryptonite and he just put Superman on his back. I told him to stay hungry. The last time I talked to Joe, I told him to stay hungry. You have, you have to know when to smell blood. You have to know, you have to have, you have to use your fighter instinct at all times. When you're in the ring, you have to use your fighter's instinct. And Joe has a clear advantage on Ryan Garcia, and he must use his fighter instinct. Don't wait for the game to give you any tells. You got to know. You have to know. And uh, the WBC League is about to start up. I'm going to... Uh,
You know, I'm trying to see right now if, uh, if I get to fight multiple times. I might, I might get to actually get three fights today, man. Uh oh, they need some replacement fighters, man. Some guys ain't pulling up. I told them I'll fight. I'll fight. I'll fight everybody. Put me up against. Put me up against the crowd. I'll fight them all. I told them put me up against everybody. Thank you. 
So who's up next? Uh, Joe from the John got it done. All right, guys, I'm going to be up in 30 minutes. In 30 minutes, I'll be fighting. In 30 minutes, it's going to be me versus me versus master. Me versus the master B in 30 minutes, bro. Me versus the master B. I can't wait. I can't wait to get them. You can't catch Moby Dick with a stick. I can't wait. 25 minutes. Let's go, sleepyhead. Boy, sleepyhead up, baby. I'm up. I got the secret sauce right here. You, you ever wonder why I hook so good? You ain't drinking the right shit. This is how I hook so good right here. Ah. Woo. This will get it done, baby. Woo -wee. Woo -whoop. Oh, yeah. I can't wait. No, let me get a jam, man. Let me go ahead and get a jam in this thing, man. Let me see here. I don't want y'all to see what I'm doing. Let me do it on the other screen. You see, you like you like that one, BZ? Yeah, bro. I, w I commented a little bit, but then I had to start looking at my phone. But yeah, man, I, 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 wanted, I wanted you to... Yeah, you needed that win for sure, man. I was like, I need you to get the killer instinct. I need you to smell blood in the water. And then you did. I like that. The killer instinct came out. You got to use your instincts. So let me get let me get a song or two going, man, cuz it's a, it's a little it's a little boring. I don't really care about this matchup right here. All right, so let's go with the. Uh, give me a little song, man. I know uh, some of y'all know I like Soldier Boy. So let's get a little. Let's get a little Rick and Morty. Some of y'all know I like soldier. Some of y'all don't know. Y'all gonna find out. Wait, I don't know if I clicked on the right song or not. Did I click on the right song? This might be a remix. I don't know. Might be a remix of Rick and Morty. If it is, I probably won't listen to it. I don't know. Go ahead and there we go, y'all. Rick, 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 Rick.
Yo, go Kush. <laughs> Make <it> Woody. <laughs> Yo, we're going to have to get on. Oh, they messaging me again. Rick, Rick. Let me see what they're talking about. Hold on, baby. Hold on. Okay. 15, 15 seconds and you're good. Start when you're ready. Hold on. Not right now. Right now. I'm, I'm busy. Hold on. Say 15 seconds and you're good. Oh shit, I got to fight right now, homie. They telling me I need to I need to fight right now, big homie. I don't know. I think this might overlap. It's not I'm not going to be done in time, bro. Let's see here, could you stream in VC for our fights? Could you stream in VC? Oh shit, I gotta get this mouthed out, bro. I gotta get this mouthed out. This is not good. We got top back, bro. I got too many fights coming up at the same time. Oh shit, give me a second. Got my top back. Let me get rid of all these tabs. I got I got work to do, y'all. I got work. They switching up fights on me and all types of things, bro. Let me get my shit together. I'm fighting. I'm doing different stuff. I'm in a situation, bro. I got to start knocking people out in one round and shit. Line up. Car chat. Where the fuck is my controller at? Oh, here come my controller. I don't know what I'm doing, y'all. I'm just fighting. I'm just I'm just here to knock people out, bro. Who I'm fighting? We finna find out. I don't know who that is. I gotta tell WBC if they can push me back.
All right, so we need one for the main car. Who? So they want me to uh, start up. Let me see here, y'all. All right, so I'm about to fight. Um. So I'm about to fight. I don't even know who this is, but uh, I'm about to fight this guy. And uh, let me see here. I gotta. I guess I'm just gonna screen share. So I'm gonna go live right here. So I got that going, and then they want me to be. I think they want me to be in the VC. the bathroom real quick. All right, y'all. VZ up in this thing, man. This is not what I want to listen to. Oh, shit. I hit the wrong button. This is not what I want to listen to at all.
says, uh, the hunt. Not right now. Y'all better figure it out. Dang, kids. My goodness, children, children, children. I see you, I see you, Zay, main event. Zay, I see you. You said you better show up. Am I fighting Moisty today? Nah, man, I can tell you right now, I'm not fighting Moisty today, man. I got I got other other things to do. I got some other stuff on my on my plate. Me and Moisty will not be fighting right, right now, man. In fact... I got some more stuff. If, if Moisty want to fight me, man, I got some more stuff to go about it, but it won't be today. I got some. All right. All right, go. I got some more stuff uh, coming up about that, uh, about that Moisty thing. Trying to get situated, man. Trying to get situated. Trying to get ready for the fight. <sighs> Feel free to hop in the VC. We are next. Okay, so I'm fighting neighborhood. Where is in the V? Okay, I'm trying to hide in the VC right here. It won't let me hop in the VC. I've been clicking on it and clicking on it. It's not letting me.
All right, I made finally I got into the location. I'm in the VC. Awesome. So I got a fight coming up. I guess I'm gonna fight neighborhood. Guess I'm gonna fight neighborhood. Um, I was I was trying to have my jams going and stuff, but I guess I need I need to turn off as much stuff as possible. I feel my computer, uh, like slowing down or doing whatever it's doing. It's, uh, acting up. Let's see here. Neighborhood, all right, your screen share will be able to start soon. Okay, so. This is definitely not my favorite matchup, but. It is what it is. I'm gonna rock this matchup. get back to the stream stream guys all right man i think i actually i think i'm gonna actually have three fights today man it's gonna be this fight i'm fighting neighborhood i think i might still fight raven and i'm gonna fight master all right so i think i got three fights that i'm gonna be doing uh right after this fight i'm going straight to go fight master right after this fight So how was my nap, bro? It was good, but you see me, I was slumped over in a seat. I was I was slumped. Somebody had KO'd me, bro. Uh yeah. Reek's Reek's pretty good, man. Um uh, uh man, I don't even I don't you know, I don't even know what to tell you. Reek's Reek's pretty good. I'd be careful. Uh, did y'all already say what fighters y'all are picking? It's going to be a heavyweight. Yeah, I don't I don't know. Yeah, I don't know about heavyweight, bro. Heavyweight is going to be some totally different totally different sauce, bro. I couldn't tell you how like how he how when I fought him, you know, I think we fought like Vulture weight or lightweight how I fought him. It's not going to be the same fight in, in heavyweight It won't be the same fight. So I don't know. I don't know what you might see And I fought him like almost three two three weeks ago Two or three weeks at least for me is like an eternity man. I, I, I've transformed like three four five times uh in two or three weeks, bro. I've transformed a lot into it in, in that amount of time. So he might not even be the same fighter if he'd been in the gym like I've been in the gym. He might not be the same person. Okay, this is Raven.
Okay, so yeah, all right. This actually is this is gonna be my only fight on EBF because it's pretty much already over with. Um, I thought I was gonna fight Raven and and Reek, but I'm not. So um, I'm just gonna fight this fight, and then I'm gonna go over to uh, WBC, and I'm gonna fight that fight, and those will be my only two fights of the day, I believe. All right. Ask me to get ready, I'm ready. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Stream. Here we go. Fight fans. Here we go. Fight fans. Let's see what I got. Let's see what I got. Here we go. Fight fans. That's what you've been waiting on. I've been sleeping. Y'all probably was taking a nap with me and stuff. Here we go. Fight fans. Let's see if I can sniff it out real quick. Let's see if I can sniff it out real quick, fight fans. So far, so good, fight fans. So far, so good. I'm not as nervous as I have been like the last 10 fights. I'm not that nervous. So that's a good sign. I'm feeling good. He doesn't seem to be showing me nothing, nothing just yet, so. didn't seem to show me too much that round so that that was okay that was a pretty decent round I think I won it I think I won it he whiffed a lot of shots so I'm pretty sure I won the round I think my percentage is better hitting them pretty flush if this is going to be a strategy the whole fight i think i'll be all right guys i think i'll be all right it might have to go to decision it's a 10 round fight that's okay
can try to give me some uh little power right there it's working on my body a little bit he's working my body some I worked his body in return since he's working me I'm working him Not looking too good right here at the end of the round. I don't like how I ended it. I don't like how I ended that round. But that's all right. Thank you for the follow. Certi certified. Thank you for the follow. I don't like the way I ended that round, but I'm still doing really, really well. Stay doing the outside in. Yeah, I appreciate you certified. Yeah, we're going we gonna to stick with it. working me pretty good on the body again I have to be pretty careful about that Try to sauce them right there. Try to sauce them real good. Oh, that was nice. That was hella nice. Yeah, definitely don't get sucked in. That's how that, that yeah, right there you tried to kill me. That's how you get killed when you get sucked in. So we're not going to worry about that. <clears throat> All right. Doing pretty good. Uh, thank you for the follow. Dalmata, y'all guys stick around. I got another fight right after this one. I got another fight right after this one. Going to the WBC to box right after this fight. Y'all stick around. So I'm down by one point, surprisingly. I thought I won two of the three rounds, but I guess not. I don't think he really wants to fight me at all, bro. To be honest, I don't think he wants to fight me at all. I could tell how he came out after he seen the card. He doesn't act, he wants to beat me on the card.
Yeah, that's exactly what I need to do. We'll see if I can make it happen. We'll see. All right, yeah, it does need a good fix versus uh southpaws. They need a fix real bad, but you know we're we're gonna do we're gonna do what we can do. This is not gonna be a KO fight. I can see it right now. It's not gonna be a KO fight unless somebody makes a a terrible decision. If somebody makes a real real bad decision, it'll be a KO fight. But as of right now, it doesn't look like that. I hate how I'm ending this match, bro. I absolutely don't like how I ended that round. That's fucking terrible. That's terrible as hell, bro. That round, awful. Started off good, and I, and I, I don't know, I dropped the round. Oh my god, bro. That's bullshit right there. Oh, straight bullshit. That fucking angle. I couldn't do what I wanted to do with that angle. I, oh, I couldn't stand that angle, bro.
I don't know, shit, you tell me. <laughs> I would have been had I got that knockdown, but uh, I fucking whiffed it. I whiffed it because he's a southpaw. That angle's terrible, and I, I whiffed the knockout because that's how southpaw rolls, bro. That's how it rolls. Oh, that's some bullshit. That was straight garbage right there. Golly. I should have been more I should have been more careful. But I think that's the fight, guys. That's it. I have a hard time with Southpaws. I really do. I think the game's just like uh, it's just so it's so I don't know. It's hard to deal with Southpaws. That's the best I can say. That's it right there. So it's difficult to deal with Southpaws. So I think I think that's too many points, man. He's got the knockdown and the and the and the freaking uh, refs or whatever the card people they got him up like fucking eight points or something like that, bro. So I think that's it, man. You just uh, Southpaws is what it is, bro. I can't believe that um I can't believe that I'm I wasn't able to to get my own knockdown the one I was supposed to get S strong math to land punches and softball is just the way the feet lock up and everything and it's just the the way the like you really can't, really can't, like you can't hit them in the back. The back doesn't count. There's a lot of things that's, that's weird about the matchup on the southpaw. Like I went behind them and I threw hook and you get, you get no point. You get no damage throwing hook on the back of the opponent. So that's annoying, but I lost. I'm pretty sure I lost. I mean, there's like almost no way in hell I could win this. Pretty sure I lost. unfortunate it's unfortunate but it's okay sometimes you take a L Said my fight of Martinez is like fighting versus a ghost and you strong mass to land a punch. Yeah, yeah. Yeah.
There were some things I didn't utilize that I should have utilized, which probably was why I didn't get the uh, knockdown as well. There's some things I did wrong. And I just don't fight a lot of Sergios. I don't fight a lot of Southpaws. You know, he's new to the game. Southpaws wasn't even a thing until he showed up. <laughs> He's whooping my ass. Boy, he is whooping my ass, bro. He is whooping my ass. No lie. <laughs> no lie, bro. I'm catching the beat down, man. That's re that's crazy, bro. I'm catching I'm catching the straight ass whooping. So I probably should have used some uh, strategies like what I'm using right now, but I'm not, I was not a big fan of this strategy. Oh, can I be saved? Can I be saved? Can I be saved by the bell? Oh, the bell saved me. I'm not a big fan of the strategy that I'm using right now to stay alive because I just don't like to fight that way, but it's probably, it's probably the strategy that I should have used um, uh, going forward. Yeah, he's got me by nine points. It might have worked um, had I started using the strategy early on. I don't know. I He can still catch you. I'll have to continue to work on a, on a strategy for him. But to continue to work on a strategy for Sergio because, yeah, he can he can catch you no matter what. You damn near got to be Sugar Ray Robinson to, to really just annihilate this guy. Sugar Ray Robinson or maybe like a... I'm not high I'm not high up on my Canelo pick anymore, but maybe Canelo, you know, Canelo gets it done. Didn't really get a chance to spar a whole lot. So like I said, I just don't have a lot of, I was trying to get a Sergio spar in and this guy is just, he is what it is, man. Going against Southpaw, it is what it is. <laughs> Inhale. Oh yeah, bro, I'm good. I'm, uh, you know, this is an L. This is an L and I'm okay with taking this L. He beat me up. Until I get a better, better strategy versus Sergio, I'm probably gonna, you know, take L's versus a Sergio. Yeah, it's cool. Play as fuck up. So, uh, I got, I took a L. I took a L. It's all good. Um, he's a tough dude. He's a tough. A tough guy to uh, beat. Yo, thank you for the follow, Juke Beats. <laughs> get hyped up and get loud. Ah, man, I, I, I want it. Like I said, bro, like, I can't believe how the cards, look at, look at that. They only gave me one round. At the beginning of the fight, I was fighting good, and they only gave me one round? I kind of knew at the third round, I knew at the, at the, at the end of the third round when the cards went up, the, it was it is it was goofy. You you <laughs> I thought you said I was better than Reek. Uh like I said, I don't fight I don't know if I recall saying I'm better than Reek. 
Um, if I said it, then I said it, but I don't recall saying that. And uh, and hell, I say, oh shit, I'm, I'm top five, baby. But I have a hard time with Sergio's, bro. I feel like Southpaw's, you know, fairly broken in this game. Uh, I got another fight. You said he was he was trash. So what that mean? <laughs> hey man, the dude beat me, bro. That dude beat me. You know, it is what it is. Southpaws, southpaws are hard to deal with at this point in time in the game. I took an L, bro. That's it. I ain't got too much more to say about it. I took an L. I, I'm not going to say that dude was spamming. I'm not going to say he did anything wrong. He beat me. That dude beat me, bro. I got, I got beat. That's all it was to it. I got beat. So I'm not tripping none. So I got I got a fight coming up right now. I'm finna fight uh uh Master Beta, alright? So I'm finna get the code from Master Beta. And uh, I'll fight Masturbator. Uh, it's going to be a WBC fight. A WBC fight. You know, it's like I said, it's hard to fight Southpaws because when you go up against a Southpaw, it's like your right hand is broken, man. You can't even use that damn thing. You can't even use your right hand. Like, Southpaws is, is so difficult, bro. I don't know what the game is going to do about fighting Southpaws. I think at this point, if... I think at this point, if I fight a... Uh, going forward, if I see Sergio picks, I might just have to do, uh, I might just have to do mirror matches, bro. You'll show me how to deal with the Sergio. All right, I might tune in. Um, so, yeah, I was an L, bro. So, I think I think I might just have to mirror match Sergios or something. I don't know. I don't know what. I don't know what the game is gonna do about Sergio's bro I don't know it's tough dealing with Sergio's is tough bro sometimes you're gonna take an L bro sometimes you're gonna take an L uh, I've been I've been having a hard time with Southpaws but Orthodox fighters Orthodox fighter's not going to do me like that. Like how, how that shit just went down? An Orthodox fighter won't do me like that. Because the game actually works. When when the feet are facing correctly, then you can move appropriately on the mat. On, on the mat, you can move around the right way. But, yeah. Like Sergio, Sergio got two things broken with him: the fact that he's a southpaw, and the fact that he has lightning hands. I didn't let the lightning hands destroy me. I didn't let the lightning hands tear me up. But the fact that he was a southpaw, that's what ultimately killed ultimately killed me. The fact that he was a southpaw. So, we'll see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm telling, I'm telling Master to give me the give me the code right now. He say he beating them every time, parsecs or not. All right. Well, I mean, if you got the sauce for Sergio, bro, I'd like to see it. I would like to see it because uh, currently I don't have the sauce for Sergio, and I haven't had enough spars with Sergio to really uh to really you know figure them out. Cause just not there's just not enough Sergios. There's not enough people playing Sergio. Um. So it is what it is. I just haven't I haven't had enough fights versus Sergio. So that 
that's a matchup problem for me and i don't i'll be honest with y'all i don't got it figured out like most of the fights that i win i win because i got the matchup figured out i know how to win um i think i'm gonna have a this fight that's coming up is canelo this fight that's coming up is canelo versus sugar ray uh leonard so this is a matchup that i have figured out so y'all will see that uh this matchup is going to play um pretty easily This matchup's gonna play real easy. This is a matchup that uh I'm all, I are, I'm already uh So here comes the fight, BZR versus Master Beta. Um, So I pretty I pretty much know how to Yeah, yeah, I I'm, I'm streaming on Discord for for a reason. Yeah, cuz I got I got this fight versus a uh, um a uh, master. I think they want to see I think they want to see the uh the Discord stream on the WBC the WBC. God damn, why can't I say it? WBC they're watching the fight on Discord. Um. So I guess I need to pick my fighter. And uh, here we'll go right here. And I'll just ready up. Uh, actually, no, 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 no. He don't have the settings right. What is W W D Y M? What is that? I don't know. I don't know the acronym. What is W D Y M? What does that mean? What do you mean? What do you what well what do you mean? Man, we ain't doing no one X fight. This a one X damage fight? That's what they want? A one X damage fight? I guess they want a 1x damage fight. Is that what they want? Let's 
Say hell yeah. Yeah, at least at least one at 1.5 damage. I know a lot of people don't want to go with the 1.5 stand, but man, I, I I'm not trying to fight in no league that don't run 1.5 damage. If we don't if we don't run 1.5 damage, I don't want to fight in that league. Here we go. Here we go, y'all. He agreed to go to 1.5 damage. He agreed to the 1.5, so here we go. This is a matchup I know very well. Like I said, uh, that, that Sergio matchup, I still don't know very well, so... Um, I just got to figure something out, man. Uh, the only person I see defeat the Sergio matchup real well was uh, was a Canelo, and uh, that dude seems to, uh, they seem to be hating on the uh, Canelo strategy. So I'm still I'm still trying to uh, see what's what what we supposed to formulate to to get that Sergio, but right now we're not gonna talk about that. We're gonna talk about the Sugar Ray Leonard versus uh, Canelo, and. Uh, this one is a, we got really bad lag. We got a one bar lag. But this one is a pretty uh, one-sided matchup, if you ask me. This is very, very one-sided. This is a very, very one-sided matchup. Yeah, um, he said I had him at 30% HP round seven, one clean hit, it was over with. Yeah, bro, uh, yeah, man, as I said, yo, uh, I'm still working on my, uh, my, my, uh, matchup versus Sergio. I didn't, I didn't realize that I even had you that close. Normally, I have a really good killer instinct, but. I, I don't have one versus Sergio, so, you know, I, sh I struggle with that. I think if I had got the knockdown, you know, uh, I would have been in a better, 
I would have been in a better situation. Yo, I appreciate the sub, Wayne. Oh, what a power. What a power. Nice power. So that's all she wrote, folks. I'm surprised I'm, I'm not getting these knockdowns right now. I'm actually surprised. But that's all she wrote, folks. He's hurt. He's absolutely hurt right now. It won't take that much. It won't take that much, folks. There we go. So like I said, like I said, man, there's some matchups that I absolutely know to the T. And I will be dead honest. I do not know the Sergio matchup. And that's why that's why I struggled. And you could say, so you think you're better than Reek, this, this, or that. Yo, everybody out here that's been watching me fight is probably aware that that I struggle with a southpaw. Like if you're not aware of that or whatever, I guess that's just your fault that you ain't came to the stream and uh and spied on me but uh i i dare anybody to to orthodox box me you in trouble on the orthodox bro you in trouble and i think it's just uh <clears throat> i think it's just a game man i don't think it's a me thing versus sergio i think it's the game bro like it it shouldn't be that big of a deal to fight a to fight a southpaw, uh, the way the game has made it. So I I don't know if they'll ever make any changes. If the only change that can happen is that, um, he says every three punches you threw tore my entire block down to red from round seven. You fought really well and had me in survival mode. Okay, see, like, that's something that I would have to, like, if I had a spar to Sergio and realized that's that's what was going on, that, that I was doing that well, I probably would have applied more pressure. I would have applied more pressure, and, uh, and I would have tried to win that fight from round seven, but I didn't know. You got to have the killer instinct when you're playing the game. You definitely have to have a killer instinct. Wow, Joe from the John with a big old ray with a big old ray that's my dog joe from the john with a big ray they came in right in time to see hook city do his thing they came in right in time to see hook city do his thing this is what you know what i usually look like i usually look just like this versus any orthodox fighter this is how i look but when I go up against South Pauls, yo, hey, bro, hey, bro, <laughs> BZR still working on that. I'm still, I'm still in the lab on the South Paw. I'm still in the lab, y'all. But uh, my man, my man says that I did a really good job. He said I did a really good job. I just need to, uh, I just need to go back in there and, and cook just a little bit more. You know, get, you know, just pour a few more potions together and see and see what concoction I come up with, and I and I might, uh knock Sergio out on a regular basis. So it's gonna take me a little bit more time. Like I said, and that's a new fighter to the game. It ain't like I've been fighting Sergio for like a month and a half. I haven't been fighting against Sergio that long. So, uh, yo, 
but that's about it, bro. I told y'all this is a bad matchup. It's very one-sided. Um, that's a dub right there. I don't think that um. All I can tell y'all is, man, is don't ever pick Canelo versus Sugar Ray Leonard. That's a bad matchup, man. Just don't do it. 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 I appreciate y'all. I'm on that Hook City shit. I'm on that Hook City shit. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate the raid. MBK for life. I'm on some natural born killer shit for life, y'all. Maybe it maybe you'll maybe I'll get in another fight. Um I, I don't know. I don't know if I'll get in any more fights today. I got like uh Yeah, I spend time with my wife probably around like seven o'clock. If maybe if somebody needs a sub or something like that in between from now until uh If somebody needs like a sub or one of the fight cards in between now and uh you know like seven o'clock i might sub in on a card or something like that if somebody you know calls my name or they say they want to see bzr in a fight i'll be there but uh other than that i guess i i guess i'll be shooting i'll be sitting right here man i guess i'll be sitting right here maybe somebody uh you know, wants to fight me in the uh, in a lobby. I'll put out the lobby code right now. Put out the lobby code right now. If um, I seen I seen a fella by the name of TKO Barber up in the chat. I'll let you know you on the hit list, TKO Barber. So if you wanna if you wanna step right up to the plate, if you wanna step right up to the plate. I'm shooting. Don't do it, Steel Bang. Don't do it. It's going to look the same way. But if you froggy, jump. If you froggy, Steel Bang, jump. But I'm telling you, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Uh, in fact, I, I I dare anybody to bring a Canelo up in here. Anybody, not just not just Steel Bane. Anybody that think they got a Canelo, bro, that is the worst matchup. It is the worst matchup. Don't do it, bro. That's that's trying to you trying to ski uphill. That is a bad matchup. I had to learn the hard way myself. I thought I had the best Canelo in the game. I thought I was the man with Canelo. And then uh and, and then I got dusted. And I'm like, okay, I ain't gonna do that shit no more. It's that simple. I got dusted. Alright, so we got we got us another. He said he's on his way. We got us another guy. Still bang, he thinks uh he has a Canelo. They can handle. I like to do a uh, 1.5x. If he wants me to change it down to 1x stam, I will, but I like to do 1.5. Uh still bang thinks he has a Canelo that can contend with me. One of the homies is like that with Canelo. I be trying to t be trying to tell him, shelf him. Yeah, I don't think so, bro. Like I think you know after uh uh who was I just fighting? I was fighting um uh what was his name? Damn, the boy he had three different names, so I got confused. Um, 
Let me see who I was fighting. Who, uh, the guy, uh, what's his name? There goes Steel. What's his name? Uh, damn, I can't think, think of the dude's name. Uh, I was just fighting Raven. Raven, uppercut country. I was fighting Raven, and he said I was doing pretty good with Sugar Ray Leonard. So maybe if I brought the same the same style, but I was using Canelo, that might be the the right matchup for uh for um going up against uh Sergio. That might be the right matchup. Um, but if I if I had to do first pick. I would never first pick Canelo to, so somebody could counter me with Sugar Ray Leonard. And and then if I first pick Sugar Ray Leonard and then they they come out with the Sergio, then you know it's a problem. You still got to know how to beat Sergio, so Yeah, Canelo Canelo got good hooks. The problem is Canelo don't got he don't have no feet, bro. Canelo can't move. That's the problem. He got good feet, but his feet is not as good as Sugar Ray Leonard. So I mean, what do you do? I like his strategy. I can see his strategy right now. He wants to suck me into a fight. But well, you see right there, I already took him. Straight to Hook City, flush punches. Flush. Canelo can't get it done. He can't get it done, bro. I, 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 I warned y'all, I promise you, anybody Want to bring me a Canelo, it's going to look just like that. It's going to look just like that. And like I said, I like to play on 1 on 1 1.5 stamina for that reason. So I can just go ahead and just dust you immediately. You know what I'm saying? For that reason. So I don't have to sit around and toy with you for eight rounds. That's what, it, that's what it looked like. And see, like what I can do right here, I could do this against an orthodox fighter, but the game is not set up for me to fight this well against a southpaw. I don't think it's my, I don't think it's me. I think it's the game. The game is not set up for these fighters to fight southpaws. So I don't know if they're going to change it or if, or if the meta will just be to fight a southpaw with a southpaw. I'm thinking that's going to be the meta. Like, it, it, if, but that's basically it. Like, if nobody, if they're not going to fix the footwork and everything so that an orthodox can fight um, a southpaw, I think that's what's going to have to happen. You're going to have to fight southpaw with southpaw. Like, the best fighters in the game will always be will always be southpaw. I think that's what's going to happen. The best fighters in the game will always be southpaw because if you have first pick, you want to pick a south. If the best fighter in the game is southpaw, you want to pick southpaw to force the other guy to pick southpaw. Bro, what the hell? This dude is like a mini game pro. How he get up four times like it was nothing? Mini game pro. That, that's five, right? 
right there. That's five knock. This will be his fifth get up. All right, there you go. So uh, I, I told you, I told you, Canelo's not that dude. Uh, like I said, um, <laughs> punches so fast, they are fast, bro. They are absolutely fast. Um, they definitely are fast. No lie. He said I wanted to dodge for a few rounds. It wouldn't it wouldn't have helped. Uh anybody have a good anybody got a good Sergio? Step right up. Anybody got a Sergio, step right up. I need to practice against Sergio. I need I need to figure out Sergio. And I have I've been I've been fighting a whole lot lately. Like every single day I've been fighting. Every single day I've been fighting and I haven't had time to deal to uh to spar with the Sergio. I just haven't had time to to get anybody in here to uh to give me a Sergio spar so I understand exactly what I need to do to win. So anybody got a good Sergio want to come in here and uh and give me a give me a good look on what I'm doing right and what I'm doing wrong. I need a good I need a good look. I think Canelo is probably that guy, but like I said, there's no way in hell I'm first picking Canelo hoping that somebody picks Sergio. So I have to if I have to first pick, I'm going Sugar Ray Leonard and if they try to counter me with Sergio, I need to know how to win. He said, my pressure unreal. So I, I already got Sugar Ray Leonard, and I'm looking for a Sergio. Anybody out in the chat rocking the Sergio Martinez, hop up in here. Step right up. You must be this tall to ride the ride. You must be this tall to get into Hook City. Step right up. But yeah, Ra Raven got me. Raven got me, bro. Tried to do my thing. Tried to do what I tried to put together some type of strategy. Yeah, Kush, come on in here, Kush. I know you're gonna tell the truth, Kush. Come on in here. I need I need somebody that's gonna tell the truth about about Sergio and what I'm doing and what I'm not doing. So come on in here, Kush. Like I said, I need somebody to step right up. Anybody that got a Sergio Martinez, take the fight code, come in here, get these hands. You might as well get some play time. You might as well. I was tired as hell this morning. I was trying to get me some Sergio uh, spars in. Y'all should have seen me on stream. I was slumped over, bro. I was sitting in a chair like this. Neck hurting. Neck hurting like a motherfucker. Whole spine hurting. I'm slumped. I think I fell asleep for about an hour. <clears throat> and I was trying to, uh, like I said, I, need, I needed more Sergio spars. But y'all watch out. Once I learn, see my man Kush showed up, and and uh, uh again, shout out to Joe from the John, 
let me go ahead and get Joe from the John shout out. He brought he brought me a big raid up in here. So shout out to Joe from the John. Let me see if I can get it. Shout out to Joe from the John. Uh, <clears throat> that's my dog. Uh, thank you for the follow, Brian Banks. Thank you for the follow, Kush. Thank you for showing up to help. Yo, to help a fighter. Thank you for showing up, Kush, to feed a fighter. I appreciate you. Like, follow, subscribe, and feed a fighter. Where is my feed a fighter at? It's not even. It's not even up there. Where's my feed a feed a fighter at? Um, said, uh, yo, what's up, Rage King Leo? What's good? Where's my feet of fighter at? Um, I don't know where my sub thing went, but uh, I guess I'll have to fix it later. He said, uh, I said to I said to Undisputed Streamer, don't get knocked out like your father used to. He DM me like won't, uh, like won't beef. I'm like, nah, I'm joking. That's all Undisputed Streamers. It's <laughs> movie Friday. Yeah, I always say that, bro. Yo, what just happened? What's going on here? Okay. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Yeah, I always say that, bro. Don't get knocked out like your father used to. Ain't nothing wrong with that. I say that all the time. Bro, where is my feet of fighter at? Like, I, I see it right here, but it's not showing up. That's weird. What happened to the source? All right. Okay, let's go, bro. Let's go. So, I think this is a strategy that I needed to do right here. This is what I needed to do. I needed to... Twitch be bugging out, yeah. Yeah, it's bugging on me, bro. Definitely. Like I already don't like this, man. I'm already I'm already upset against this freaking lefty, man. It's bothering the hell out of me right now. He almost killed me right there with that power left. I almost lost my life.
Yeah, man, I, I think it's just the game, bro. I don't think it's me. Like, there's not a whole lot of there's not a whole lot you could do against the southpaw without, you know, running into complete suicide. You got a couple of options. Spam the shit out of southpaw, like spam him to death. Or maybe try to one, you know, one two him to death. You really don't have a lot of options, bro. And I think the best way to take them out is to fight them in a 1.5 stamina. If you get them in the 1.5 stamina uh, match, you could really mess them up. But in a 1x stamina match, they show them my fight on the EBF. Which one? The against Sergio? The Sergio fight? Oh, this one? Oh, okay. Yeah. It's yeah, it's so it's so tough to deal with the uh to deal with the Cuz we're waiting on the final. How y'all waiting on Reek? That don't even make sense. Reek Reek there. He been there. But yeah, uh it's so difficult to deal with the oh yeah I had a disconnect I DC okay that makes sense that makes sense yeah man like I think the southpaw is so broken it it really like nullifies like you can't throw your right hand you really got to be on a stand on, on like a flat foot to get your right hand in there meanwhile Sergio like really uh tears you up on on the hooks to the body so uh it puts you in a it puts you in a bad situation something about i don't know it's just something about southpaws in this game man i think they gotta i think uh still city's gotta figure it out otherwise if they don't figure it out um all the good fighters are gonna are gonna move to southpaw because it will be meta. Everybody will have to. Everybody will play southpaw if they don't fix it. Especially if you have the first pick. Because even when you stand, if you stand switch, your fighter still feels broken because both of his hands become really slow. Because uh, he's not in his uh, normal stance. So I think the, the fighters that would be that would really be meta if they don't if they don't fix how to set up uh, how to fight um, Southpaws is the fighters that are able that are uh, the fighters that can fight you know uh, Orthodox and Southpaw. That would be like, uh, Bud Crawford, Terrence Bud Crawford. He would become more meta than Sergio if they can't fix the uh, the the way the fighters fight, and they just say, you know what, screw it, it is what it is, and they put stand switching in. Then Terrence Bud Crawford would become the the ultimate troll because he could make anybody fight southpaw, and he can switch back to orthodox if need be. And I, I would definitely, at that point, like if I was first pick, I would definitely pick Bud Crawford. Uh, he'd be my first pick every time if they didn't, uh, if they don't fix um, stance stance switching. If they don't fix stance switching and they don't fix like punch tracking or whatever, orthodox versus southpaw, I would I would uh, pick a you know. Somebody that can fight both sides. Uh, what do you call it? It's called. Uh, I can't. I can't even think of the uh, the word. Uh, ambidextrous. I would get an amb ambidextrous fighter every time if they if they don't fix it. If they don't fix it and they just throw stand switching in, I go ambidextrous every time.
Cause like it's the fourth round. Y'all see me y'all see me fight um Y'all see me fight Orthodox fighters and by the fourth round I have a really good I've already established some dominance and I'm fighting Kush here. Kush feels that he's not a very good fighter. And I I do not feel like I have established any dominance because Kush is a southpaw. Uh, in fact, I feel like I'm in big danger. Like Kush could, you know, beat me up at any moment in time. Yo, thank you for the raid, uh, Cyrus the Virus. Thank you for the raid. Now, I absolutely feel like I'm in big trouble at all times versus a southpaw at all times. Just because my right hand is uh, not, not very usable because as soon as you come down mat versus uh, Sergio, as soon as you come down mat versus Sergio, it is so likely for you to get knocked out Oh yeah, yeah. Thank, thank you, Cyrus. I'll, uh, I'll turn it off. I'll turn it off. Yeah. As soon as you come down mat, you know, if you're on the red side and you walk down mat versus Sergio, you are in so much trouble. So your right hand is very, very nullified. Um, let me go ahead and turn that off. Your, your right hand is, is like taken away from you to such a degree it's uh it's atrocious to such a degree it's atrocious so i think uh southpaw fighters will definitely be the the meta going going forward if the game uh isn't fixed I was streaming the fight like it was your car on my way for me. Yeah, yeah, I heard about that. I heard about that. Um, I'm try I'm trying to get my practice in versus Southpaw man, and I think that uh, I think that the only the only remedy I have right now for us for a Southpaw fighter that's just not pure pure cheese. If it's not, you know, it's just not pure cheese, is that you gotta fight Sergio with Sergio. That's the only way to deal with this guy without um without you know throwing a hundred body shots. That's the only way to deal with him. Cause it's just uh it's just not not nothing you can do right now. So y'all see me y'all see me fighting this Sergio. Uh, if there is another Sergio out there that wants to fight after this fight, I'm gonna put the code up. You're more than welcome to come in and fight me. If there is not another Sergio, then uh Kush will fight again. The next match will be a mirror match, Sergio versus Sergio. And I'll show you that that I can beat Sergio. The problem is is he's southpaw. It's not that. It's not that he's Sergio. It's not that, you know, the person controlling the controller uh, is better. It's not that Sir, that I can't defeat Sergio the fighter. It's that the game is broken and that it's extremely hard to fight Orthodox versus Southpaw. That's the problem. It's not the player holding the controller. It's not me holding the controller. It's not Sergio on the screen. It's not Sugar Ray, Le uh, Sugar, Sugar Ray Leonard on the, on the screen. The problem is there's a fundamental flaw with going orthodox versus southpaw. I'm not, I'm not, trying, to di I'm not trying to diss anybody. I'm not trying to diss Kush. I'm not trying to diss myself. I'm not trying to diss Raven or anybody that likes to fight with a Southpaw fighter 
I'm not trying to do none of that. I'm just making a case. That's all I'm doing is making a case that the game, like the game, is fundamentally uh, a problem. versus a southpaw like i'm i'm literally right now six rounds sugar ray leonard i'm struggling my ass off and i promise you it won't be that way and i am not a southpaw fighter i'm not used to the buttons being backwards or nothing like that and i promise you it won't be that way in a mirror match Like at this point, <laughs> at this point, Kush might Kush might fucking beat me up at this point. Like I might lose to Kush. It's just that it's that bad, man. Like I wouldn't I wouldn't be surprised if Kush just knocked me out. It's that bad. I would not be surprised. And I I ain't hating on you, Kush. I'm not hating on you at all. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. It is extremely hard to establish dominance versus a southpaw extremely hard <laughs> like that right there man he just walks out of that like like it's nothing man sheesh and this is a this is a one a 1 1.5 stamina fight 1.5 Damage 1.5 stamina, and I am struggling. I am struggling. So you know, here it is, fight fans. Y'all want it? Y'all want to know what's up? You want to know? Uh, is is Sergio meta or not? Uh, unfortunately, unfortunately, Sergio is definitely meta. And the only other thing that I could think like um, to go up against Sergio is like maybe you allow Sugar Ray Leonard, I mean Sugar Ray Robinson to fight. Um, I know all these different boxing clubs, some have bands, some don't, this, this, and that. It's kind of hard to keep up with, but uh, Sugar Ray Robinson is like the only guy that could really deal with a... Uh, really deal with the softball because he is OP as hell because he is super OP but it shouldn't take me a sp this is a 1.5x stamina fight I don't I think the fight that I had with Raven was just a 1x stamina fight and on 1.5 it shouldn't take me this long to uh it shouldn't take me to the seventh round to get on Sergio's ass. It shouldn't take me this long. So that technically means like the seventh round here means like, you know, round 12. It was a one, it was a 1.0. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Cyrus, it shouldn't. So technically where I'm at in the fight right now, if it, uh, it's at 1.5 for me to have these same results, uh, at 1.0, it would have had to been like a 15 round fight. For me to even get close to having Sergio in the situation that he's that he's in right now, it would have it would have took me a long time to uh, get him in this situation. I would say that I'm in a bad situation myself right now. Uh, if this if this were a competition fight, I wouldn't want to be where I where I'm at. Even though Sergio seems to be in a worse situation than me, I wouldn't want to be where I'm at. Yo, congratulations, Kraken. 
Who who'd you go up against, Kraken? Porter versus Martinez. He was Porter versus Sergio Martinez. Wow. That seems like a matchup I would never, ever do. How in the world did you pull that off? That is a matchup I would never, ever pick. If you don't want to share the sauce, it's okay. It's okay if you don't want to share the sauce. Oh my goodness, this is taking all day to deal with this, Sergio. It's taking all day. A lot of a lot of your body shots. Yeah, yeah. I hear you, I hear you. You know, yeah, maybe maybe just maybe it's just me. Um I feel like I feel like Southpaw's a problem. I'd, li I'd like to, you know, if you have your video of your fight, I will watch it with you so I could, you know, check it out, kind of see the strategy, see the strategy that you used and things like that. Um, but man, I struggle. I struggle more with this Sergio than I believe I struggled with Canelo uh, back when I first was getting whooped by Canelo a whole lot. I struggle more with this. I struggle more with this Sergio than I've struggled with any matchup in the game, uh, outside of like George Linares is basically another Sergio, but at least he's not Southpaw. <clears throat> at least he's not Southpaw. <laughs> okay so my next fight i'm gonna pick i'm picking sergio and anybody in the chat wants to has a sergio that wants to fight me if they don't um if nobody shows up kush I'm hoping Kush will run it back with me and Kush will uh, be the Sergio and we'll see we'll see how much differently uh, this fight goes. In fact, go ahead Kush. We're not we're not even going to wait on nobody else. Go ahead Kush, come on back in here if you got time. It'll be the same fighters, the same people. I'm still me, you're still you. The only thing that's going to change is that I'm Sergio and it won't be uh it won't be orthodox versus softball and we'll see if we still have to go I think that was like a round nine knockout or something like that we'll see if I have to go nine rounds So this will be a this is a perfect like a perfect little uh, chem, uh, chemistry test, you know, a little mathematical test or whatever. Um, I literally fought the same way that I've always been fighting. It's just that I'm very aware that uh, there's a danger there's a danger zone when fighting a southpaw where you will get knocked out. You will you will get flash KO'd if you walk into um the the left hand of Sergio 
and I am not a southpaw fighter, but I do have a little bit of an idea on how to use a southpaw. It might take me a round or two to, to get my bearings or whatnot, but I'm almost a thousand percent, almost a thousand percent sure it won't take me till the eighth or ninth, the eighth or ninth round to, uh, to do what I need to do. This is so backwards. This is very, very backwards. It feels so weird. Yeah, it is very it is very weird. It feels like my hands are moving at some crazy angle. I don't know. I don't know why. Uh, sheesh! Like even that movement right there was crazy. Like I got to do everything backwards. The screen is moving differently than what I'm used to. He says, like the back straight is different. He says, it feels so weird. Then in a split second, the decision to jab, you naturally throw a straight and all the directional punches are backwards. Yeah, it, yeah, definitely Cyrus. They're, they're all backwards. His hands look funny. It looks like I'm trying to fight in a mirror. Um, I'm throwing my my right and I feel like it's power but it's not power uh <laughs> I'm jabbing I'm dra I'm jabbing right and I'm thinking I'm I'm like I'm thinking it's like a power jab or something it's crazy like my brain is all backwards I got to walk differently I got to go up mat I can tell you right now, I'm already like a thousand percent better than what I was with uh with Sugar Ray Leonard, and I'm still having my brain is still adjusting, and I'm still better than what I was with Sugar Ray Leonard. I can see it. That was a nice I don't know what that was that was a, a a left a nice power left <laughs> okay so just off of that alone that was the second round I'm pretty sure you're gonna see a fourth round knockout I'm pretty sure you're gonna see a fourth round knockout if not this round. I'm not really used to his guard. Well, there you go. 
There you go, right there. I'm not used to his guard neither. I feel like I'm supposed to be hitting certain punches, but it looks really weird. I'm hitting glove. Some of the angles are really strange. My, yeah, my left hand, I'm hitting straight glove, and that's really weird. I don't even know what to think about that. I'm hitting glove, and it's... So yeah, um, yeah. I for I foresee uh, Terrence Crawford being the next the next man up as soon as they put stand switching into uh, online play. Ter Terrence Crawford will be the new meta without a doubt. Without it, I mean, one thousand percent. I foresee Terrence Crawford being the next dude that's really gonna bother every single player. Oh, he has that trait too. Oh, yeah. Definitely, definitely those two. Roy Jones is already high, highly picked. And then uh, you give him stand switching on top of that, he'll be a menace. He'll be an absolute menace. Yeah, yeah, I, I was there. I was there when they put stand switching online. And they took that thing like away immediately. I don't know if uh just playing this guy for I don't really play Sergio Martinez. Obviously I don't. Just playing Sergio right now. I feel uh I'm sure he'd feel different uh, he'd feel different versus uh orthodox. But just playing him right now versus doing the mirror match. It's a uh, I never like mirror matches. I'll say that for one. I don't like mirror matches in orthodox. I don't like mirror matches. Um, I think his his right hand is actually um really really tough, man. I think his right hand is really tough. That's what makes him what makes him dangerous is really working the right hand. And then if somebody's fooling, foolish enough to get in the phone booth with you, 
you drop that left hand on him and uh, and you win the fight. You KO KO him. But I think it's his his right hand that's actually the uh, dangerous hand. It doesn't seem to be. It doesn't really seem to be his uh, left hand unless somebody is foolish enough to allow you to destroy them with your left hand. And I'm sure there are plenty of foolish people out there. He could really go crazy with the body. Oh, shit. Look at that. I ate that left hand. He threw that left hand. If you're foolish enough to walk in Sergio's left hand like that, that's what's going to happen because of lightning hands. That's what's going to happen. His right hand's really where it's at. And if you're crazy enough to walk into that left hand, you're going to get one punch KO just like that every time. And surprisingly, not surprisingly, not surprising, uh, it works. It works southpaw versus southpaw. And why it works is if you ever use George Linares, George Linares can one punch KO you at any time because he has lightning hands. Because speed kills in this game. He has lightning hands, so he has the ability to get you with that KO punch at any time. So I didn't do work as fast as I thought I would do work. I thought I uh, I thought I'd be done before this round was over with, before the sixth round was over with. I am still learning, Sergio. But I do think that I do think that he's a hell of a, a meta style fighter, without a doubt, especially if you're better than me with him. Because he destroys punch tracking. He destroys punch tracking, stick tracking, whatever you want to call it. He destroys tracking. I think I'm doing really bad right now because I've had like bad stam stamina management. Uh, just getting used to his body position and where he's standing and things like that. I'm getting tore up in the body a whole lot. So I don't have a lot of power. But yeah, I could see this. I don't know if I would take a Sergio into a competition fight anytime soon because I don't play him, but maybe I should start playing Sergio. Um, should start playing him more often and seeing how effective I am versus versus uh see how effective I am versus orthodox players. So I may I might just sit on I might just sit on Sergio for the rest of the day. I'll sit on Sergio for the rest of the day. See um see how effective I am against other high level, high skilled players if they decide to come in the channel and spar with me. See how it works. 
Uh, he definitely throws me off of my game. I don't know if he throws uh, all the other orthodox fighters off, but he definitely gives me the hardest time. Hey, what's what's good, uh, young raccoon? He said we could spar. I'm with it. I'm with it, young raccoon. I'm with it. Give me one second. I'm going to ski the code real quick, and I'm going to use the bathroom, and then we'll spar. We could do Sergio versus Sergio, or you can pick whoever you want. I'll be Sergio. You can be whoever you want. Be right back. there we go so I'll give you a second uh, it's no problem it's no problem cracking it's no problem man I'll spar with you anytime anytime you need it bro anytime you need it yo is that you young uh, young raccoon are you little wing Um, uh, I might, I might do that, uh, uh, in a little bit cracking. Mother monitor. Yeah, man. I wish I had three monitors hooked up. Okay. That's you. All right. Awesome. I wish I had three monitors hooked up so I could watch, I could re watch the, the stream chat and watch the fight and, uh, fight at the same time. <laughs> I do have a lot of monitors here because my wife works from home too, but at this very moment, I can't do that. Dad, you need more toilet tissue. All right, get it right oh. there. Oh, okay, thanks. Mm -hmm. Answer the call, watch my screen. Um, just give me a second, big dog. Let me see here. the call up what's up what's up man got it um I don't see anything right now nah I just see your your little alien creature I do not see the screen yeah yeah go to MBK um, we'll be in the, uh, let's go to, I don't know which one's open for everybody. I guess, uh, try the, uh, check-in. All right, try the check-in. Um, 
um sorry for making you wait uh all right this is perfect this is actually perfect because I was struggling versus Sugar Ray Leonard and you picked Sugar Ray Leonard. So let's see if I do better. Uh, no problem, Kush, no problem. Let's see if I do better on the opposite end. If I'm able to defeat Sugar Ray Leonard easier than um, being Sugar Ray Leonard. This is a good, this is good, interesting. I'm guessing he's not able to get in there, so let's do I don't know, I'm trying to deal with it. You couldn't join the voice. Hey Kraken, just join whatever voice you can join. If any voice is available, join that voice and I'll just follow you. Whatever one you can get into. Um, I don't even know which one you sent me. Did you send it today? Okay, here we go. You did send it today. I'm here and I'm in the voice channel. I'm in the hang I'm in the hangout. This is perfect. This is perfect. All right, man. I'll I'll have to I'll check it out in a second. Sergio definitely, huh? I see some, I see some wrinkles, I see some things. Oh, I thought I killed him right there. I thought I murdered that guy. I see some things. Yo, what's up, Freshy? <laughs> it's just cold in here, man. It's cold in here. I see some things. I see some wrinkles. I definitely see some wrinkles. Obviously, with um, Martinez, obviously I can see right away with uh, with Sergio. If you're gonna play him, you have to be you have to be careful of your defense. You have to be careful of your defense big time he feels like he feels like Gotti like right now it's uh, the way the way he feels he feels like a Turo Gotti so you have to be very mindful of your defense
<laughs> so I try to do some different right there. Yeah, he's way too dangerous. He's way too dangerous, bro. Sergio is way too dangerous. Look, y'all see that? Do y'all see that? Stream, do y'all see that? Sergio is way too dangerous. This is what I'm talking about. I was able to apply a stupid amount of pressure and Sugar Ray is kind of uh, in a he was in a bad situation early in the fight. Bad situation. Look at that. Oh my god, I should have lost that transaction. Did y'all see that? Y'all seen it from from my from my stream. That's lightning hands, guys. That's lightning hands. Did you see that transaction? Did you see that? Holy shit. Lightning hands literally over overrided him hitting me first. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Who was paying attention? To how fast that punch came out and rocked him. Oh my goodness. That's that's lightning hands in a bottle right there. <laughs> Absolutely. Did you see? It was ridiculous, Cyrus. Did you see? That was absolutely ridiculous that I even caught him with that punch in the first place. That was insane. That dude's left hand is so powerful, it's absurd. Absurd. I'm lit like I don't even play Sergio Martinez. I do not play this guy. And I was able to go to go absolutely ape shit with his left hand. Absolutely it what round is it? It's the third round. Absolutely ape shit with Sir look at that. Ape shit with his left hand. The dude is straight broken. Straight broken. That was wild. You talk I I'm literally I'm I'm playing him. I am Sergio and I shouldn't be getting knockouts like that. I'm playing the dude. I should not be getting knockouts like that. That was absolutely crazy. <laughs> yo, yo, look at yo. Young Raccoon says he is broken. That is absolutely nuts that I was able to just lightning strike that dude like Zeus ult absolutely nuts and he hurt me too y'all see oh y'all couldn't see that my stamina was down but my stamina was actually down uh because I got I got my uh, stand bar blocked um on this I'm supposed to have the I'm supposed to have both people's stand bars blocked yeah um absolutely absurd you're gonna see me i'm gonna continue to play sergio um for like maybe one more hour um because i'm gonna you know go on a dinner dinner date with my wife give my wife some one-on-one -on -one time but i'm gonna continue to play sergio for a second and it was a good fight, uh, Young Raccoon. GG, it was a good fight. I'm going to continue to play Sergio uh, for a little while, but he is absolutely broken. Terrifying. He is terrifying. That was unexpected, to say the least. Unexpected. Um, I mean, it what I guess it... it it was unexpected for me to um for me to feel it the way the way like for me to be on the side of 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 dishing out the damage i'm normally the one taking the damage from sergio um and i see why like i know not to walk into his left hand i've been fighting against him 
The first time Sergio was, was released, I was fighting him, Southpaw. I walked into that left hand, he, that left hand, he flash KO'd me immediately. And I've been trying to figure out a way to deal with it ever since. And I, I pick up the fighter. I'm not a Southpaw fighter. I'm like, let me go ahead and give this a try. Immediately dropping KOs with the left hand. He is light. Lightning hands in this game is broken, guys. George Linares, Sergio Martinez, and probably any other fighter that has lightning hands is absolutely broken. And then on top of that, Southpaw is broken as well. Southpaw is absolutely broken. A lightning hands is broken. This guy is a two and one. A two and one. Uh, but clearly he's uh, he's gonna be a meta fighter. So you might you might you guys might start seeing me uh pull up uh oh yeah you sick yeah you guys might start seeing me pull up as a uh, Sergio into competitions uh going forward until they until they fix it until either the competitions ban Sergio if if nobody's going to ban Sergio I'll be picking Sergio every time I'm here to win I'm not here to do nothing else but get dubs bro I'm here to get dubs and and I already heard it I come in there and I lost to Raven, and then the first thing out of somebody's mouth was, "Oh, you think you better than Reek? You think you better than Reek? Well, I mean, this dude's broken right here, bro. This dude's broken, and if I did a mirror match, I think I could get a win. I think I could get a win. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure I could, I be that dude. Um. This dude's broken as hell. I'm just, I'm just put, I'm just putting it out there. I'm just putting it out there. You're gonna see me roll up at Sergio and do a whole lot of broken stuff until the league tells me I can't do it. And if I can't do it, nobody can't do it. So then you'll have to fight me as orthodox, and I still whoop that ass. That's how, that's how we going that's how we gonna go going forward. Yeah, that's how we're going to do a going forward fight, fans. You're going to see me pull Sergio until they say Sergio is, is, no, is not available. And then if it's not available for me, it's not available for everybody else. And then I'm going to whoop that ass orthodox too. So it, ju it just is what it is. I'm here to win. Put on a show and win. Yeah, it's uh, a abs absolutely Cyrus. Like the, I'm telling you, bro. The lefty is broken. The lefty is broken. And this game has no fix. I don't. I don't foresee them being able to patch in something to fix fighting southpaws until the game releases. I don't foresee it happening anytime soon. Uh, in any of these patches, they will not be fixing lefties. So you got two options. You either play lefty or when they bring in uh stand switching, you play some you play somebody like Terrence uh Bud Crawford that um what's that word that I said earlier? They're um amb ambidextrous. That's going to be the meta in the game. You're either going to have to play southpaw or ambidextrous fighter. Those are your two options because orthodox fighters are going to be just orthodox fighters are going to be sol bro they're going to be shit out of luck orthodox fighters are going to be sol and the only way you could you the only way like i would never pick like i'm saying this is what's going to happen going forward going forward i will pick a southpaw fighter like the only way that going forward if i got first pick i'm picking sergio martinez i'm picking a southpaw fighter I'm, i'll put it out there for everybody it, it don't matter it don't it don't matter y'all think y'all can win y'all think y'all can win i'm picking a southpaw fighter because it's broken i know it you know it she know it he know it we all know it i'm picking a southpaw fighter if i'm first pick if somebody else is first pick and they don't pick a southpaw fighter if they pick an orthodox fighter then i will fight orthodox but if i'm first pick i'm not going to put myself in a situation for somebody to pit to pick southpaw 
and then the fight, you know, not be equal, you know, not be able to, you know, be able to box. So that that's a, you know, a defensive mechanism. If if Sergio's on the board, I'm going to pick him every time. And uh, if they take Sergio off the board, then all the fights will be orthodox fights and I'll fight orthodox. So you heard it here first. You heard it here first. I used to be a Canelo fighter. I found out real fast that outside boxing is is stronger than inside boxing fighting in the phone booth. So I switched to outside boxing. I'm fighting outside boxing. I found out real quick that you could get smurf by a southpaw. So now we going we going southpaw box. I mean, there's just, it's just, it just is what it is. There's certain things in the game. If you want to be good, if you want to be on top and you don't want to have no excuses, hey, bro, play the meta. Play the meta. Play the meta. That's all I can say. Play the meta. Have I seen Sergio get defeated by Orthodox? Yes, I have. Uh, would most people say that it's spam just from a, 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 a fight fan perspective? I would say without, without a, uh, without a doubt, without a shadow of doubt, a million percent, most people would say that how the Orthodox fighter needs to fight Sergio to beat him is spam. So you got two options, be a spam fighter or pick Sergio. I try not to be a spam fighter. Uh, so I'm gonna pick Sergio. Um, and this just all has to do with, you know, with pick rotations, with pick rotations and bands. That's what it really comes down to pick rotations and bands. Um, obviously if somebody's got first pick and they pick Canelo, I'm not picking Sergio. Like I'm not doing that. I could beat Canelo with, with many fighters. Um, so it's just certain it's just certain matchups, you know. You guys got to know if you want if you want to win, if you want to be a winner, you got to know your matchups, bro. You got to know your matchups. That's the big that's the first step to being a winner is knowing your matchups. And I have really been going against the grain with Sergio, but I guess I got to be a Sergio like the other guys is is beating on me. I've been going against the grain, but hey man, my head is only is only so hard. You hit me in the same side a couple of times, I'm gonna get rocked. Just like all these other fighters on Undisputed. You get hit in the same spot, you're gonna get rocked. So it don't look like nobody wants to fight me right now. Nobody's answering the call. So I'll go ahead and just do a a, a quick match with Sergio. And uh we'll see what happens. In the Sergio quick match. Oh, hold up. Why is this dude? He said, Go Davy. <laughs> Yo, Big Daddy Puff trolling me. Yo, earlier today on this stream, Big Daddy Puff. Whoop my ass with George Davey. No lie. I happened to be Dalton Smith, and he came in there uh, with his outboxing skills and, and jabbed my ass into the ground with George Davey. No lie. I think that was a bad matchup as well. George Davey versus, versus Dalton Smith. That was a bad matchup. All right, so here we go again. The same matchup we just had. Unfortunately, this is 1x damage and 1x stamina. So it's going to take much longer to do work. Obviously, it's quick match. Yeah, Davey, Davey's got that long-ass jab, bro. He got the best jab in the game. 
I think it's the best jab in the game. It's pretty fucking good. So we got the same matchup. Sergio versus Sugar Ray Leonard in the quick match. We're going to see if I can destroy Sugar Ray Leonard. We're going to see what happens. I didn't see what level this guy is. If he's a new fighter or uh, if he's a veteran fighter, I, I, I forgot to look. But we're going to see if I can destroy him. I guess this guy is already aware of what Sergio Martinez is all about. And he does not want any part of me right now. I'll have you know that we are in a boxing ring and you do have to fight. <laughs> I'm spazzing out, bro. Uh, yeah, I think this fight's already over with again. Just by that transaction right there. That transaction right there was not good. That was not a good look. That was not a good look at all. I could see that this might end real fast. Not a good look. And you know what? I just noticed something right there. I threw I threw my left. And if any of y'all noticed, whenever everybody that's a fight fan that plays this game notices that the lead body uppercut, it tracks to a certain extent. When you throw it, it kind of sucks in the fighter. It's kind of got like a little stick tracking. I noticed right then and there when I threw my left, it sucked in the orthodox fighter. I felt I felt it pull him into my punch. Just like I was throwing a lead body uppercut. Bro, this guy is stupid fast. Stupid fast. This is this is funny, bro. This is actually funny. This is this is funny beyond belief. I don't know. I don't know if y'all, you know, y'all are paying paying attention to details or whatnot, bro. But this is actually funny beyond belief. I could level. I level change three times, three times with some crazy spam that's all deadly, all deadly. I'm talking about all deadly KO punches. I level changed three times. If this was 1.5 damage or 1.5 stam, he would have been murdered. I level changed him three times in one stam bar. It's absolutely ridiculous what Sergio's able to do.
You see that right there? I went over the top on that man so fast. He's trying to figure out which area to block. I tell you, I'll tell you, I'll tell you straight up, bro. Lightning hands, lightning hands is ridiculous. I'm playing reckless right now. I'm playing reckless. Lightning hands is ridiculous. Over the top again. Paparazzi, paparazzi over the top. Hook City. And you know what the worst thing is about this guy? Is that even if he's stamina deprived, his hands are so fast that he can still KO you. He can still KO you with speed alone. That's the problem. His speed can KO you. You see that right there? Speed, speed got that guy. His speed can KO you. That's the problem with this guy. It's not like a Canelo punch where you just hit somebody with all power. This guy don't even want to fight. He qu he quit. He surrendered. This man's speed alone can KO you. He can put you in. This is a 1x damage, 1x stamina fight. And his speed alone can blaze you with the level changes. I level changed the guy three times. I could have level changed him four times. I could have went head, body. I could have went head, body, head, body on each side. I could have. Yeah, that was one X damage, bro. That was a quick match. I could have went. I could have went to the left side of the head, the uh, the right side of the body, the right side of the head, left side of the body, all all in one one situation. I could have. Yeah, he needs. A, he need. He definitely needs a band, bro. <laughs> I'm telling you, I could have hit I could have hit him the punches I'm throwing is KO punches. I could have KO'd him on any side of the body, any side of the head at any time, bro. At any time. And I'm and I'm telling y'all right now, if you don't ban Sergio Martinez in the league matches, I will bring my Sergio Martinez to the league match. And y'all gonna hate me. Y'all gonna hate Hook City. I'm just going to do what you allow me to do. I don't want to do it. I don't want to be Sergio Martinez. I really don't like this fighter. I don't like Southpaws. I don't want to be Sergio Martinez. But if that's who I have to be to win, I'm here to win, baby. BZ here to win. So this is a uh, this is a guy. He's a level 8, so this don't really count. But we'll just see what happens. This this. I think it's supposed to be Sergio's kryptonite matchup, but we'll see what I could do. We'll see what I could do is see if I don't get hit by kryptonite right here. Even though he's a level eight, kryptonite's kryptonite, right? We'll see what I could do. He's not, I mean, I would, I would prefer him to be a level 30 Canelo. If he was low, level 30 and above, I'd be like, all right, this is the real deal. He's not a level 30 Canelo, but we'll see. We'll see if a level 8 Canelo can, can give me a hard time. We gonna see. He's not pressing the A button. 
for whatever reasons. He's not starting the fight. So I guess we'll just take our time. Or maybe he already quit or what I don't know. But we're waiting on the fight to start. So y'all gonna see a whole lot more Sergio from BZR. Uh, yeah, I could take him, bro. I could take him. Oh, I could definitely take him. Oh, I could definitely take him. I could definitely take him, bro. <laughs> That's hella funny. That's hella funny, bro. I could definitely take Canelo. It won't take that long. It won't take that long. Dude, that was a that was a clean a clean left to the face, bro. Anybody else would have died instantly, but Canelo's got that that iron chin. Look at that double rock. Look at that double rock. That tells you something, bro. If that don't tell you, I don't I don't know what does, bro. If that don't tell you, I don't know what does. If that don't tell you about this guy, man, I don't know what to tell you, bro. Lightning hands. We already know. We already know Canelo is strong, but Sergio should not be doing the shit that he's doing. That lets you know right there. Lightning hands. We already know C C Canelo got the bear claw. Sergio should not have a bear claw, but he does because of them lightning hands. It's out. It's outrageous. It's outrageous. I guarantee you this guy going to leave too. As soon as I put him on a canvas, he going to hit surrender. He going to hit surrender. Unless he comes to the stream just to watch me. He might, you know, a lot of people like to come to the stream. But he going he's going to hit surrender, bro. So like I said, y'all 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 get used to seeing me. Y'all get used to seeing me rock Sergio. I mean ridiculous. Did you see that that double pump to the body right there? That's game over. In most fights, that's game over right there. That pump to the body. And then if you if you try to do anything about it, I'm so fast, I could just I can just counter your counter. That's ridiculous. And then I could just hit you in the stomach on the other side. <laughs> he got me. He got me. That was because I was in loose foot. That's absolutely nuts. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, man, this guy is hella broken. Look at these transactions, bro. Did you see these transactions? Did you see them? These transactions are 
are insane. Look at how fast I go upside this man's head. I've never seen nothing like it. I've never seen nothing like it. Look at how fast I do it. I'm already a fast fighter. I'm already fast. And this guy's got me broken fast. I'm already fast, bro. You watch. Y'all gonna see it. Y'all seen it here first. I take Sergio into a competition and I hit somebody that fast, they're gonna complain. They're gonna say, get Sergio up out of here. I didn't complain. I, I took my L. I said, yo, Sergio kicked my ass. I did not complain. That's what happened in the tournament today. I took my L. But now it's time for me to pass out some L's. Transactions with this guy is ridiculous, bro. Ridiculous. Look at that. Straight to the belly. Instant. Instant transmission, bro. Instant transmission. The punches that I'm throwing at this guy in a one in a 1.5 damage, bro, they would be knocked out immediately. Immediately. I would have, like, how I just knocked him out right there, I would have did that shit in the second round. I would have took the dude's head off immediately at Sergio. He'd have been done, toast. Maybe in the first round, I would have I would have cooked him because he's so fast. I would have cooked him in the first round probably. This is a third round cook. This dude's got a titanium jaw. Third round cook. Third round cook on 1x damage, bro. Pay attention, people. Third round cook on 1x damage against Can Canelo with a titanium forehead. Titanium jaw. Pay attention. I ain't telling no lies, bro. I'm just telling it how it is. I'm just keeping it 100. Somebody get into a fight with me. Anybody in the chat want to wanna spar with me. I'm gonna show you exactly what a 1x, what a 1x, a 1.5 hook city with what Sergio look like. I'm gonna tell you exactly what it looked like, bro. It looked like gas up the jet. It looked like gas up the jet, bro. Like, look how fast some things is coming out. Look how fast some things is coming out, bro. That shit is ridiculous. Look at me level change on them. You see me go to the body, to the left head, to the right head. And I went back to the back to the middle body like it was nothing. Because my hands are fast. Look, I went to the middle body, to the top of the head, back to the front of the head, to the back of the head, to the front of the head. I'm reading my target and my hands are so fast. I don't, I don't even have to think too long. I don't have to think at all. Look how fast my hands are. As soon as he changes hands, I change my hands. I don't have to think that hard at all. All I need to know is that I'm faster than you. It's that simple. I don't have to think that hard. I'm faster than you. You think about what I'm doing. I don't have to think about what you're doing. You won't do anything. You won't do anything because you're too slow. Tell me Sergio not broken. Okay. 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 Tell me Sergio not broken. Okay. Yo, thank you for the follow, Zombie Hun. Zombie Hun. Thank you for the follow.
there's a there is a lot of skill in the game don't get me wrong there's a lot of skill i got like 300 almost 400 hours in the game there's a lot of skill to be had in the game but there there are also really bad matchups in the game really bad matchups that skill uh would have a hard time to overcome dead serious they're really bad matchups and there is skill it's two different things oh uh, yeah uh uh zombie hunt yeah this is this is a really good game as you just heard i got almost 400 hours into this game uh i really like it it is early access it is uh it's not complete as you can see right here i'll go to the to the main hub you can see right here they got a banner career mode coming soon store coming soon as you move over where it says the career tab continue your pro, your pro career coming soon load a previous career and start your undisputed career coming soon so these things are not in the game yet but they are coming when the game fully releases and i personally my personal opinion i don't believe the game will fully release until next year that's my personal opinion i could be one million percent wrong and then you got you go over here and they got create a new boxer browse online created fighters so if i made a fighter you could probably like circle through uh like go through the browse and find my fighter and then they have browse local created fighters that's if you were like playing on the same um pc and you had a friend over couch co-op and you wanted to use the same creative fighter and make it really easy so right now yes there are uh, the game there are a lot of things missing in the game it is early access there are a lot of fighters missing in the game they don't have all the fighters they don't have all the modes they don't have everything they want to have but is the game worth thirty dollars right now absolutely the best thirty dollars i have spent in a very very long time absolutely i'm not talking about just year this just this year's best 30 dollars i spent this year last year and probably the year before that and maybe even the year before that best 30 dollars i spent in a long time so we're going to continue to uh to use uh sergio and, and just go ham and, and show y'all exactly uh you know what i'm dealing with out here man what i'm dealing with yeah i got whooped by sergio yeah i got whooped by sergio but i won't anymore because next time i see a sergio i'm gonna be sergio Uh, yeah, I, I hear Ali has been broken for some time, um, but I haven't played a whole lot of heavyweight, so I haven't been uh, using Ali or fighting Ali, so that is not in my uh, my book of knowledge, zombie hun. That is not in my book of knowledge. I wish it was, so I could tell you, I could tell you 100% right or wrong. I've just heard through the grapevine that that Ali, you know, is what he is. But I can't tell you from a personal experience. So here we go again. We finna go crazy with the, uh, finna go crazy with the Sergio.
So I think this fight is already almost over. He ate a bunch of bodies. Didn't really defend himself. He ate a really nasty left hook right there. Took that thing flush on the chin. He's turtled up real heavy right now. He's turtling up real heavy. I think I put too much punishment on him. Right out the gate, he's punished. And he's trying to go in his turtle shell. He's taking flush, flush hooks to the face. And that's a KO, baby. Uh, you seen it here first. I told you. Took him straight to Hook City. Immediately. Easy money. Easy money. And he don't want to fight no more. That's how easy it was. It was so easy. It was brutal on that man. Brutal enough that he was like, yeah, first round, yeah, I'm up out of here. I don't want none of that. Easy money, bro. I wonder what the leagues is going to do. I wonder what the leagues are going to do. Will the boxing leagues get rid of Sergio when I dominate the field? When I dominate the field with Sergio, will, will they ban him then? I need, I need, I need y'all to tell me, fight fans. When I dominate him with Sergio, will they ban him then? It's going to be some domination. I can tell you that. I can tell you that's for that's a 1000% fact. It's going to be some domination. This dude, this dude left hand is ridiculous. Yeah, well, if they nerf him in the, No, I'm not uh when I say when I'm talking about uh I'm talking about the boxing clubs that uh that are doing um promotional fighting stuff like that they're doing a uh, competition fighting the competition fighting the competition fighting leagues are allowing Sergio to be in the competition so 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 long as they allow Sergio in competition matches I will use Sergio and I will abuse my opponents I will use Sergio and I will abuse my opponents until they get them up out of here but that's not gonna stop me from being a good boxer because I can box orthodox the problem is, is that South Paul's broken. That's the problem. This dude's already done, bro. He caught too many hooks to the face already. He already caught too many to the face. He's already cooked. Told you he was cooked. I told you he was cooked already in the first round. He was cooked. 
took too many punches to the face. It's already over with. On 1x damage, it's already over with. That fast. The man is extremely dangerous, bro. Extremely dangerous. <laughs> I'm testing something right now. I'm testing some. This guy, this guy clearly has a boxing IQ. He has some boxing IQ. He knows what he's supposed to do. And I'm testing something now. He's got boxing IQ. He might not be good at the game, but he knows what he's supposed to do in a boxing match. I could tell by, by the way he's moving his feet on me. <laughs> all right, all right. Yeah, I could tell by the way he's moving his feet on me. Like he he understands, you know, what he's supposed to be doing. So this is interesting right here. This is what I was looking for. When I keep fight, if I keep on playing and I'm fighting fighters like this. Somebody's going to teach me how to beat Sergio Martinez. Somebody's going to teach me how to beat myself. Somebody's going to have to show it. This is a per this is a perfect why didn't I think it is? This is a perfect strategy. This is a perfect strategy. If you don't like a fighter, get good at him and make somebody else teach you how to how to get whooped. <laughs> why didn't I think of that before? I didn't think of that. Just get good with the fighter and then somebody else will show you what to do. If they don't, yeah, that's what he's doing right now. He's, he's trying to stay on outside foot. He's attempting to do that, but I'm still catching him. So that means that this is not a viable strategy because I'm still, I'm still just dominating him. No matter how hard he circles, I'm dominating this guy. So I want, it's not a valuable strategy because the game is broken. That's why. Not because it's not the right thing to do in boxing, but it's because it's broken is what I keep, what I keep trying to tell people. The strategy is correct. The effectiveness is broken. He's using the correct strategy. The effectiveness of the strategy is completely broken. So, oh, he's going to get up. Yeah, Goose. I took I took a fat L to Sergio Martinez. I got whooped. I got beat down. And I, and I said, never again, Lord. Never again. Never again, Lord. I got prayed up. And I said, teach me how to be a Southpaw, Lord. And he brought me Sergio Martinez as my servant. And 
And now, if they would just take him out of league play, I wouldn't have to be this guy. But I guess they want me to beat everybody up at Sergio Martinez. So they go ahead and get him up out of here. Look at that. Golly, did you see the paparazzi? Did you see me put him on a poster right there? Oh my goodness, that was ridiculous. <clears throat> that was absolutely ridiculous. It said, yeah, I was saying to other NBK fighters that Martinez is your kryptonite so far. Surge and King, Dre, and I are trying to work something out to start the league. And if... Uh, shit, I mean, I, I would like for this dude to be banned, but he don't have to be banned for me. I'll just be him. Turns out, I got a real nice Sergio. My Sergio good. My Sergio clean in a motherfucker. What you talking about? My Sergio tearing his boy up. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Sergio versus Sergio. I'm not going to do Ray versus Ray. Hey, baby. Ray. Oh. How are you? I can't like almost today or tomorrow. Uh, we'll see. Okay. Look at that. Look at that, bro. I don't even... I don't have to... I could Sergio versus Ray. I'm just going to stay Sergio full time. Probably the only time that I won't be Sergio is if I go up against a Canelo, I probably won't pick Sergio. That's probably the only time. But even then, I destroy Canelo with Sergio. This fighter is OP. I can't think of a... I can't think of a situation that at this moment, I can't think of a situation where I don't need, where I would be a different fighter other than Sergio. It makes it easier for me to fight Canelo because he's, he's orthodox or whatever. And I could just go ahead and pack him up, but I might as well stay Sergio full time. Uh, You know what I'm saying? So I don't lose my skills. I mean, look at look at that, bro. Hook City to Southpaw way, baby. Hook City to Southpaw way. It is what it is, man. It is what it is, bro. This is what people want to do. This is what they want. This is what they want from me. This is what they're going to get. I'm going to give them what they want. Sergio's, he, he's not my kryptonite. He's a, he's a, he's an orthodox kryptonite. And it's a problem. The game is messed up. It's a problem with the game. He ain't my kryptonite. There ain't a fighter in the game that's my kryptonite. There ain't not a fighter in the game that's my kryptonite, man. I can be I can beat Sergio's. I can beat uh what's the name? Uh Sugar Ray Robinson's. I there's they're not a fighter out here that I'm worried about. The problem is that he's a southpaw and he breaks he breaks the fundamentals of the game. He literally breaks the fun the fundamentals. So in order for me to unbreak the fundamentals, I have to play the same fighter. But that dude, Sergio, don't don't scare me not one bit, bro. Not one bit. Um, let's give a big raid to my man Gotcha Mitch. I'm gonna raid Gotcha Mitch, man. Uh, he's playing a new WWE game, and I'm interested in it. I, I've uh, been sucked into these fighting games as of lately, and I'm interested in WWE. So let's check out Gotcha Mitch, man. I'm 
I'm gonna watch the I'm gonna watch uh Gotcha Mitch with y'all. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be a fan with y'all and I'm gonna watch Gotcha Mitch. Hey baby. All right, we raiding Gotcha Mitch. Uh, and five, four, three, two, one. Let's OC Gotcha Mitch. <laughs>